on my desk. Dynamic is really cool because both Godot and um, Phoenix are just John and Jeremy speaking in their regular voices. I gotta say, it's really Basically. funny when I just start a stream uh, without telling any of you. So that, that that's way, it's just so great. it starts in the middle Dude. of someone's fucking sentence. It's awesome. Dude, look at this yeah, fucking that's, guy. That's always great. That's <laughs> look at this fucking sick. Real common writer. That, that, that looks like the, he looks like the Red Hood. That with a knife right. attached to him. That is officially uh, now my favorite common writer. Oh fuck off! <laughs> He's so good right now. Watch I don't know any other comment, Michael. Writing, so it's yeah. a low bar. Final Fantasy XIV keeps staring me in the face, and it makes me sad. Ah, uh, shush. Maybe I later. Play Final Fantasy IV. Huh? Maybe, maybe, maybe later. All right. Can everyone? Can everyone see? Um. No, I'm. I uh... can. I'm watching you in code. Gotta say, Michael, it's pretty unprofessional. They're making a new Spy Kids movie? Ah, uh, thank god. Anyways, we're here. Spy Hey! How? Wait, I'm sorry, hold on. They're making a new Spy Kids movie? It's a what? Reboot. It's a reboot, yeah. With oh, oh yeah. never mind. I've lost oh, all Oh, it's interest. a reboot? Ooh, sh direct to Netflix? Spy Horrible. Kids Armageddon? Oh, it does. Uh, I do <laughs> not have faith just looking at those kids. Anyway, uh, is it time to law? Those yeah, the it's exact time, kids I it's time to law. Yeah. Yeah. They're not the exact kids. They are not. Horrible. Yeah, no, they're, it's not the same kids. It's not. It's Carmen not the Judy. exact same kids because the kids aren't kids anymore. That's what yeah. a makeup so, department's for. So just a CGI de-age them, dude. No, honestly, that wouldn't be de-aging. That would just be CGI children. Folks, Did you want yeah. bad them news. To invent, I've opened like, Steam Big Picture mode. Fucking serum. Already awesome. Um, Steam big picture mode speed run. <laughs> All right. How fast can uh, you escape from it, I, like Houdini? Spy Kids Armageddon is automatically inferior because it does not have Antonio Banderas or Danny Trejo. That's true. That is true. Uh, Instead, right. they have Zachary Levi. <laughs> Anyways, bleh. I have to. I don't. I, 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 I forgot. I had to like instantly get into an old man voice. <laughs> I forgot so they had Elijah Wood in Spy Kids. They had everyone in Spy Kids. Who did Elijah Wood play? The guy. The guy. Oh yeah! I forgot. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> How do you the guy? How do you forget the guy? We All talked right. about this like a yeah. week ago too. It's the guy. <laughs> uh, I always forget that they had Sylvester Stallone. He was another one of those pesky young types. Wearing a broken pair of spectacles. He had a newspaper in his right hand and the noisy brat kept rustling its pages. Oh, how could he? The young man was listening to the wireless. I remember that well. To the to the wireless, yes, we're all hooked in at all times. Then the serving girl in question brought over the Jabuchino. My favorite. The little fidget picked up the cup with his free hand and took a sip. Ah, oh, dainty. And then he died. The testimony we have just heard, to test how credible the witness's memory is. It seems to me that he remembers the victim in a great deal of detail. Oh yes! I hate those you-know-what types who are so vague about everything! How are we gonna handle this, Nick? Simple. I'm going to dissect his, his testimony with great detail. We just need to prove that the old man's memory is shot. Just trip him up, you mean? Isn't that kind of cruel? He's old. That's why it's cruel. Nuh uh, nobody cares. Society you doesn't just, value just the elderly. You go to I care about the elderly. The doctor and get a certificate saying that Victor Kudo yeah. has donkey brains. <laughs> but guess what, Your Honor? Nobody cares about your opinion because you're elderly. Okay. Your Honor, kill him. <laughs> I a think broken... I will. <laughs> Bailiff. A broken pair of spectacles. Yes, sir? That's kill not... this man. Uh, shall I be using the K-74 or the rocket launcher? Rocket launcher. Okay. I like how you, you say better rocket go quick while I'm loading it up. Okay, so he didn't have a newspaper. He wasn't wearing a broken pair of glasses. There's a little lot here. <laughs> oh, no, wait. No, did he have a newspaper? I don't think I have a picture of the, uh... 
Because you, you there was something. What was the what was the like the message written on? It was not written on the sports paper. Oh yeah, it's the sports paper. Okay. Uh this actually might I think okay, this is a newspaper. Alright, so we did have a newspaper. He was listening to the wireless, quote unquote. Uh she didn't bring him a Java Chino, but that's not really I don't think I can push press on that. Picked up a cup with his free hand and took a sip. He didn't have any hands. Uh, it's kind of impossible to tell dead. what he was holding the cup with, but it was probably his right hand. Which would make him a double liar. Um, He's actually I'm gonna, a dog. He leaned over and licked it. I'm gonna not press, because this is officially a speedrun. I'm just gonna present his portrait. And just hope for the best. <laughs> Did music, it work? Music's still playing. <laughs> yeah. Damn, it didn't work. Well and done. Did you not, not save? save? I saved! <laughs> Okay, you didn't load. He just, he just wanted to make, he wanted to make sure. I right, can see I can nothing, see nothing faulty. faulty. Unfortunately, I'll have to okay. penalize All right. you, Mr. Wright. You know Wright. what, Your Honor? Oh my God! It's kind of is that uh, what? Wait, that's not. That, wait, stand. yeah, that's not. That's not. That's bites the. You're supposed to say bites the dust. No, it's okay. I use a water dough, and then I just like shove my hand in, <laughs> into uh into the fucking stand's heart, and I twist it counterclockwise. Uh -huh. okay, so, wait, uh, so the stand, the JoJo stand's living? Yes. Oh. Nope. I'm just, I just wanted to try. <laughs> hey, believe it or not, you, I don't think you have to press. Not sure, but I think really? you don't. Watch it, watch it literally just be that the sports paper isn't a newspaper. Uh, I, I guess I should try. Although it really does look like a newspaper. Okay. Ratioed. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Don't load each Out time. Of... It might not be like efficient. Out of curiosity, it might not be does efficient. it? Whatever. My curiosity, does it mention? Well, I guess it wouldn't matter. Because he... all he said was he picked up with his free hand. I wanted to see if uh, if anywhere it mentioned what what hand like like on his on his portfolio or uh, autopsy what like if he was right handed or left handed. But I don't think it matters. Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> the young man was listening to that wireless. Little fidget. I've never heard a human being referred to as a fidget. I have. Uh... Interesting. Okay, Honestly, I'm just gonna I press, don't... I guess. I read the transcript yeah, and I don't even usually... know where they're going with this. I, I don't this think I've heard... One. Fidget either. Usually the kind of people who say fidget just rather say spaz. Yeah. Whoa, I don't Spectacles. think they can say that though. Yeah. Spaz when okay, is spaz I've a slur? Never seen, yes, it is. How? Of, especially in Britain. Um but mostly it's, it's I've, I've only ever heard fidget and I don't think that's an appropriate I, I, substitute. I've heard Australians. No, 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 no. I'm not. Fucking, no, I'm not like saying a, it's an appropriate substitute. I'm just saying that usually the kind of people who would be okay with saying fidget are usually the kind of people who would say spaz. I've never heard Wrong fidget. Disagree. Time. I've never heard fidget. People who want to say you have you're acting hyperactive guardians. will just say spaz. Anyways, dark glasses to you. One of the lenses was green, but the other was broken. Newfangled rubbish. That's why I remember him so well. That's not yeah, some kind of lens over his left eye. It's not, but <laughs> but I wouldn't have called it a pair of glasses. More of a he seems to have been wearing some rather modern-looking shades, or should I say shade, because there's only one of them. Perhaps I should take some, just steal them from the local department store, and rival Mr. Godot's sharp appearance. Like, Very uh, we better come up with something sharp and quick, like a knife, maybe a gun. Alrighty. Like I've heard people say fidgety, but not fidget. That's not. The newspaper like... was a sports paper, was it? That young hooligan. I nearly asked him. Can't you even read without fidgeting? Hmm. How was I supposed to be able to read the back page with all that wrestling going on? I need to find out if Gustin Braun retained his championship title. Oh, well, here, I have the paper right. This is a photograph. <laughs> it was his paper, not yours. What are you looking at me like that for, hmm? Ow. 
I, I, what is that? Guts and Braun got beaten yesterday, by the way. Anyway, what is that? Mean? Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> Tell the old man. The wireless? The wireless? The decadent the wireless? young rascal. In my day, it was one or the other. Read the paper or listen to the wireless. Well, I don't think he was reading, bro. And using an earpiece. It's selfish, that's what it is. I was straining my ears, but I couldn't catch any of it. What the fuck? What are you looking at me for like that? How do you feel sorry for me? I don't. I don't feel sorry for you. Stop looking at me like that. I'm. You're, I'm literally a lawyer. Stop. I mean, you are on the defense. Stop team. looking I at me and jet. No. Or on the whatever you call it. Shut you mean the, the waitress fuck up. You only saw from behind, right? You're one of those, are you? You never let anything go, isn't that right? Well, it's my job. What does it matter if I saw her from front or behind? My eyes don't lie! Okay. Rude? Is this gonna happen every time I push? His free hand? Yes. Which hand was that? Yes. Weren't you listening before, cloth ears? Okay, wow, that's a new one. I said he was rustling the newspaper with his right hand, didn't I? If his free hand was in his right hand, then which hand was it, you moron? <laughs> just Something ha. remarkable just happened. Perhaps the great Mr. Trite has three hands. Well, maybe you have three hands. Loser. I do. The whole point of this cross-examination is to establish just one thing. But this old guy's memory has more holes than a slice of Swiss. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we just need to find a contradiction in his testimony somewhere, huh? Anything will do, even the smallest detail. Well, I've already fucking presented three small details. Wait, 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 can you, can you do me a favor? What? Can you look through your evidence real quick? Attorney's badge, Magger Tammer, Magazine Clip Hound, Sparse Pepper, Job Lastings, Lunch Special, Gene Scooter, Glenn's Autopsy Report, Trace Beyond Floor Plans, Crime Fatal, Cafe Coop, Victim's Lateral Ticket, Epron, Potassium Cyanate, and the Victim's Prescription Bag. Alright. Are you having a stroke? I'm proud to announce I have figured it out. <laughs> cool. That's awesome. We're guilty. Left that victim do this. I sure have it, and I've read the transcript. <laughs> Widerman Square? That's like a Dragon Ball name right there. I don't know. Thought I remembered something. Lube, lube, lube. Tender Lender? I don't remember that. <laughs> Who the fuck is Gene? Gene Armstrong, the French guy. Oh, right. Um, he's my French, name. so it's Jean. I'm. Oh, I'm, you know, I'm actually, if, if, if I'm right, which I'm almost positive I am, I want to see if you get this, because this one's kind of fucking weird. Yeah, having Michael just explain it to me in DMs, this one is really tough, and if you get this, you're impressive. Oh, shit. He had to have been holding it with the right hand. Oh my god, he got it. <laughs> literally, literally me and Andrew being like, man, I wonder if he's gonna get this, Jeremy. Oh, he had to have held it in his right hand. Us, what the fuck? Uh, <laughs> Mr. Kuda, do you remember what you were told at the start of this testimony? That this was a way of testing the credibility of your memory? I know, I know. There's nothing wrong with my memory, I tell you. Nothing. If I got anything wrong, I'll eat these seeds and sing the pigeon song. Uh, I would. All right, here we go. I would really want to see that. Where was this going, Trunt? 
Yeah, according to Mr. Kudo, the victim was holding the paper in his right hand uh, while drinking coffee with his free hand, which would make that his left. Ah, what is this? Kindergarten! But I would like the court to please look at this. That, that's the cup the victim used, correct? Why are you so shocked? Yes, and on the rim, you'll notice the mark left by the victim's lips. Yeah, there is a stain left by the coffee. If you consider where that stain is, you'll clearly see the victim was holding the cup in his right hand. Uh, Ergo, but, pigeon dance, please. But I'll take now. pigeon dance to go. Pigeon dance for me. Sing the pigeon song and do, do the pigeon dance. Ah! Rubble, rubble, rubble. Right? Do the pigeon why dance. Why have I just now noticed you wearing the, the tightest song. spandex pants? If you don't sing it, it's unacceptable. It, it, I think it, the witness is better go back to the park where he came from. He said nothing. Do you think I'm going to stand here and listen to you tell me I'm mad? You're wrong. I don't care about that dirty coffee cup. I know what I saw. You, you still insist on your testimony? Oh, sorry, that young Brad was holding that cup in his left hand. Oh yes, no question. I'm a good law-abiding citizen, I am. It's that dead young hotbot and you, you spiky-haired yahoo, who are at fault. Hotbot? Who, me? Thank you, old man. We've heard quite enough from you already. Don't call me old man, old man! Been around for 68 years, I have. You can't ignore me. Watch. Listen to what I've got to say! <laughs> nope. <laughs> Do I don't feel like it. <laughs> Sorry, bucko. Moving on to the next witness. Sure. Why not hear what? a little more? Mr. Godot, no! <laughs> You've ruined me, Godot! This is my 16th cup of coffee. Oh, shit. So this is your final stand. Thank you, Captain! You can rely on Victor! Can't? Goto, is there something you're not telling us? The boy was wearing the ear pierce on the same side as the green lens of his specs. Uh, okay. He kept fiddling with it all the time. Sure, that's probably true. He was fiddling with it just before he picked up the cup, too. That's likely. And then he used the same hand to pick up the cup. His left hand! Uh, immediately incorrect. <laughs> you know what's in my cup right now, Trite? Um, Joker Toxin. Knife will. Oh. Just pure knife. <laughs> Just pure Very awesome. cool. Just pure. We know that the victim was wearing an unusual monocle over his left eye. Just call it a scouter. It wasn't a monocle, Your Honor. That was a limited edition Dragon Ball Z scouter. Huh. A limited edition Dragon Ball Z Scouter? You mean, like, a television show? Yes, the inside of the, s the lens has a screen that displays computer data. Called an HMD. It's a common tool in the victim's line of work. HD, TV, DVD, CD! CD's nuts! <laughs> you can't- did you just D's nuts yourself? Yes. <laughs> Anyways, all these new fangled <laughs> all these new fangled letters drive me mad, but they don't matter. I know what I saw, and I'm telling the truth. It's true. He doesn't seem to be lying. And those are the facts in good old black and white. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's very cool. Uh huh. Yep. Yep. A Rooney. Super cool, dude. You are a really. Really sweet old man, I tell you what. Just present I'm gonna the see if I can just present, <laughs> just present the same the thing again. <laughs> Did it not work? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh shit. Bad news. You're an idiot. <laughs> no. <laughs> Going to have to shoot the rocket launcher. Penisized. All right. Wait, you didn't before. Why is Rumi here? He's like the dust, I remember. Technically, that hasn't happened yet. So, technically, because he keeps going back in time, every time he gets penalized, the bailiff is just 
shooting him with a rocket launcher. An MC bomber. What is this psychopath doing? Which is a really funny visual to imagine. Just Phoenix being, but what if? And the judge being, no. And then just a <laughs> explosion. Left eardrum was ruptured. <laughs> oh, that's an ouch. Yeah, that's a that's an oof. I forgot we talked about that in the previous his episode. Medication. We discovered that information. Yeah, his medication was for his ear. Yeah. But uh, I think I can probably just present his profile. Uh, does he say anything more specific than that, or no? Okay. I'm not sure what the relevance of this is, but... Mr. Kudo, there is something very strange about your observations of the victim. What? You say he was wearing the earpiece on the same side as the HMD. No question! You can lock me up if I'm wrong! It was his left ear, without a doubt! You gotta stop taking these gambles. I could only see that side of his head from where I was sitting. Hi, I don't think so. What, 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 what did you no. say? <laughs> Fuck you mean, not uh -huh. you're no doubt. You're no doubt unaware of this fact, Mr. Kudo. But the victim couldn't hear with his left ear. His eardrum was ruptured. Eh? Traces of medication for his condition were found in his ear canal. That's right. It's impossible that the victim was wearing his earpiece in his left ear. Because he couldn't even hear in that ear. I... Uh, can... Is that true, C Captain? Yeah, I didn't tell you. <laughs> uh, p p p pigeon. <laughs> pretty pigeon. <laughs> rubble, 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 pretty pigeon. I love this right one. Now. Order, 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 pretty, pretty pigeon. pigeon. <laughs> the witness's testimony is completely unreliable. He only saw the waitress from behind. And he claims the victim was wearing an earpiece when we know his eardrum was ruptured. Well, Mr. Goto? <laughs> My brain! A single drop of milk is all it takes to destroy- Wait, no. What am I saying? Something's wrong with my head! <laughs> my mind- My mind's being clouded with- Smoke. Strong thoughts! A single drop of coffee I'm good. is all, all right. it takes to, I'm to good. ruin a great uh, cup of milk. I'm good. All right. That's it. You skipped it. I'm not saying this. Okay. <laughs> Captain! Oh, are you all right? There was smoke coming out of your head and everything. It was, it was fucking weird. It hurts. Okay. The was helping. Aren't you going to, like, pass out in, like, an hour? Maybe. That's why my last cup of coffee is gonna be a clean, just, like, mug full of five-hour energy. Um, I see! Mr. Godot, I'd, I'd like to inform you that that is actually Dayquil, not Nyquil. Uh -oh. oh! This is the victim's coffee cup in which the potassium cyanide was found. The mark on the rim clearly shows that the victim picked up with his right hand. Oh, that I back down! I know I'm right! The lad drank his Jovachino with his left hand! Let me put it out of your misery. <laughs> Clearly, the victim used both hands. He took a sip with the cup held in his right hand and then switched to his left. That's what the old man saw. It's impossible. The witness has already testified on numerous occasions that the victim died immediately after taking just one sip of the coffee. No. <laughs> Which hand the victim used to pick up his coffee is irrelevant, Your Honor. The fact still stands, with one hand or the other, Mr. L drank the poisoned coffee. <laughs> like this! Sadly, Mr. Hey, Goto, no. that doesn't wash. The point of this testimony was to establish whether the witness's memory is credible. And the results are clear. 
The testimony given by this witness is useless. Five hour energy is going through my veins. <laughs> rubble, rubble, rubble. Five hour energy. I believe it is time to, to conclude today's proceedings. Because I don't feel like continuing. I'm satisfied that the witness is not deceiving the court. That's cool. Just kind Agreed. Of but to be frank, his testimony is a farce. Did you have to be so frank? Yes. My name is. Take that, you pompous old fogey! You can't throw that. I'm far. sorry, Mr. Kudo. You can't reach me from there. He's got a gun! <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Alright, it looks like he can reach me from there. <laughs> I'm you sorry, Mr. Just Kudo. You just broke an entire launcher. spud cannon from beneath the podium. Please refrain from killing me. You are in a court of law. It'll be very easy to testify against you. I'm you know, ordering the defense and the prosecution to investigate this further. Please. That's all for now. The court's adjourned. Oh, no. Do I fire the rocket launcher at him? Oh, yes. shit. Wait! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If we stop now, what does that leave me? Well, you gotta do the pigeon song, and you go to prison. Leave you, Mr. Kodo. Coot, coot. Coo Thanks to that blue suited young upstart over there. I'm just a bumbling old man who can't even cross his T's or. Who can't even dot his T's or cross his eyes now! Damn, you almost said it correctly. That would have been catastrophic. It would have been for my character. How is your bad memory my fault? I'm sorry, Mr. Kodo, but there's nothing I can do. You take that back. Kudo, <laughs> forget you have dementia. <laughs> I've kept oh, my mouth shit. shut until now. He's about to reveal his evil twin. But there's something else the court should know. If this guy what? says that I mugged him, I'm gonna freak out. <laughs> I've lined the there's court more? with explosives. <laughs> to be perfectly honest, it might not be anything. But I want another chance! I want another crack at you, you young shark! M ma Well, everyone. What do you say to one final showdown? What the fuck? The final chapter in this eccentric old man's scrapbook! Sorry, Gramps. As much as I want to beat his ass, I've already had my 17th cup of coffee. Are you okay? I'm kind of tired. Something's happening Fuck. in my body. <laughs> what have you got to lose, Captain? I'll give uh, you all the Java Chino you want if you come to my house after the trial. Whoa. I think my heart's stopping. I may be 68 <laughs> years old, but Victor Kudo is still a man. No, you can't Yo. die yet. Go to only 83 more cups till enlightenment. Next okay. year, it'll be different though, right, Kodu? <laughs> I, I, I swear to God, you take that back. That's enough, witness. I believe it will be quicker for the court to just hear your testimony. You bet! Much, much quicker! I can't believe this is happening. What do you mean, Maya? This happens all the fucking time. You better get ready, youngster! I get it, I get it, alright. Could you just quit throwing whatever the hell those are at me? Gotta be using some sort of infinite ammo code with that box of seeds. God, I'm so funny. Even I don't think he knows what that is. Right. Phoenix Wright plays video games. Well, first of all, I was Halo. Oh, yeah, no, he does not. I wanted to stress that this might be nothing. I'm not too sure of myself. The young boy slumped over the table as soon as he took one sip of his Javachino. Well, the clumsy idiot upset the vase. He knocked it right over. What vase? It broke, and the strip of cloth covering the table got completely soaked. What vase? What the fuck are you talking about? You know, the, the vase that in that vase? picture that's standing You're up. You're a complete <laughs> buffoon. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, what how about that? Turn things upside down. Hmm. Uh, you know, no, just, not really. Lie. He just lied. Guys, can I call this one perjury? <laughs> I no, no, think no, no. so. Obviously, obviously he's telling the truth, and Maggie Bird just replaced the vase before passing up. Yeah, that's what a good waitress would do. Yes, that's all. I remember it all perfectly. Right. Eh? You're doubting me again? You're doubting a poor, defenseless old man? Right, I'm gonna be his ass. <laughs> we are not doubting you, Mr. Oduk. No. 
I believe everyone. I swear to fucking God, Judge, you take that back or I'm bringing out this spud gun. I have a rocket launcher. Yeah. So what? <laughs> That's all I can think of, and I have to cross-examine this guy. This is gonna be the shortest cross-examination yeah. of all time. <laughs> You're a bird brain. That's why that's all you can think of. <laughs> Very well, Mr. Wright. Your cross-examination plays of the final variety. I don't mind if I do. All right, speed on, speed on, speed on. <laughs> I gotta find the right line though. Ah, uh, wait. Oh, but it broke, or he knocked it over. Uh, well, it it's not, probably it's... doesn't matter. <laughs> I hope it doesn't matter. Okay, cool. Mr. Kudo, this is a photograph of the crime scene. Mm, so what? <laughs> you notice What's anything that? peculiar? <laughs> the vase is there, completely intact. Huh. Huh. Lost your tongue, granddad. I'm no granddad of yours, Hopscotch! Hey, I- I- Enough. It's not like a yeah, yeah. Seriously, I keep hitting the fucking- I keep hitting- I keep opening Steam. Nah, he's sure. a defense attorney. If you- it, oh, Michael, was... are you skipping these lines? No, I didn't skip that line that time. I've done it a couple times when, like, me and John, like, had joke lines and we didn't do the actual line. But no, I didn't skip that. I just remembered something. God, what now? The broken vase. <laughs> it was on my table. Q laugh track. Ah, uh, well, you see. It startled me when that young lad collapsed. So I stood up. That must have been when it fell over. The vase on my table, I mean. The vase on your table? Yeah, yeah, it was on my table, and that's how my groin came to be completely soaked. Thanks for that. Just get was the rapid really... And also covered in it. vase shards. It... Was this really just like a very long, convoluted way of convincing everyone you didn't piss yourself? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. That, that's, that's really no comment. Justified at all. I just want to say for the record, I've had this rocket launcher, but no rockets Godo. to launch. I like Goto just sitting there <laughs> smiling blankly. <laughs> this guy's a dumbass. <sighs> Thank you, Mr. Kudo. You've certainly earned your kudos for today. Uh, I'd like to ask a question now. Have I, uh... Have I been any use at all? Perhaps that's something you should reflect on yourself, Mr. Doku. <laughs> okay, now come the fuck on! Oh, wait, I remember something else! Bailiff! Rocket launcher! Bronto! <laughs> oh, shit! Oh, wait, no, I need the rockets. Wait! Don't fire! <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Anima, it's a present for you! <laughs> <laughs> Well, we seem to have been considerably sidetracked, and I'm still not in a position to deliver a verdict. Yeah, based, literally nothing was gained from that. The defendant has not been positively identified as the waitress in question. Additionally, there are two disparities in the testimony we've heard thus far. Like, literally, just hold on, was anything achieved by that? We found the apron. We found, yeah, we got some evidence, I guess. That's about it. Alright, sure. The mark on the coffee cup that the victim supposedly drank from with his left hand, and the earpiece which was inserted into his left ear out of which he couldn't hear. Wow, Nick, you did it. I therefore require both the defense and the prosecution to further investigate the facts. Yeah, Berdoodles, Your Honor. Sure. There's one more thing I'd like to call before I can call today's session ended. One more thing, Your Honor. It's dibs. On oh. what? I don't know. Uh, the witness we just heard from, he is most insistent that his testimony should be of abuse. So he's summarized it accordingly into the statement. Okie doke. You may each have a copy of it, if you wish. It was written in crayon. Whatever. 
The prosecution doesn't need props like that. It's not a prop, Goto. It's Goto's evidence. Really mad, huh? Yeah, I would be too. Very well. No affidavits for Mr. Goto. Here you are, Mr. Wright. There's three copies: my own, yours, and Mr. Godot's. Can I just yeah, actually call Like, thank you, Godot, being like, I don't need things like that, and he pulls out his little like business card booklet and files it in. I'm sorry. <laughs> What the heck are we supposed to do with three copies? That is all. This court is adjourned. Damn, record to time. Be we, went we went through three cross-examinations in 30 minutes. That well, they were pretty record. pathetic cross-examinations. They were. <laughs> I'll be right back. No. First line's gonna be his, I guarantee it. I No, it's mine. Of course it is. It's because you know it's January 7th till 2 p.m. Right and Cola offices. Doesn't count. I'm speaking from Charlie. Oh, Charlie can speak now. I, I didn't realize doesn't, that was a thing. This one doesn't count either. Sorry. Uh, so how do you think the trial went this morning? Mine doesn't count either. How do you think it went? Go it got a bit crazy in there. I just wondered if that killed count. our chances. Yeah, I guess it did get out of hand. doesn't count. Uh, Mr. Kudo's testimony did nothing at all, but... Plus, now we don't even know the identity of the doesn't count waitress who laced the coffee. All we know is that it doesn't count. Papaya. True. The apron straps and the ribbon don't count. And that the victim uh, didn't count when he was wearing an earpiece when his eardrum ruptured. If only we had someone to do a count impression right now so that something can count. Talk! This uh, one doesn't count. Uh, uh, <laughs> no! no stop. About! Ah! <laughs> uh, no. uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I'm not gonna do this. It went too long last time. <laughs> Terrifying case of contradictions. Uh, yeah. It's too badass. Uh, none of these lines are real. <laughs> yeah, we gotta find one that's real for Maggie or she's gonna have a terminal case of guilty. Alright, time to go find but a that real I mean line. She's gonna get the death sentence for this one. <laughs> oh, they will kill uh, her. She has maybe three days to live. This doesn't count either. January 7th, detention center, visitor's room. It still does. None of still. Nothing counting. Uh, I guess Maggie's still in question. Doesn't count. But, but we've got questions to ask her, too. Doesn't count. Maggie! Maggie! It's, on, it's like we're close to it counting. Keep it down, Maya. This isn't a playground, you know. Nor does it count. Your man's loss extremely, and he cannot it's, take God, it. God, it's crazy that this doesn't What's count. What's happening? Oh! Uh, this doesn't count either, man. That's crazy. January 7th, trust me in. Jimmy lost, that's all you need to know. What, what did Empty. I miss? Oh my god, it's so insane how little this counts. Yeah, and it's lunchtime too, which is weird because this is normally when it would count. Big guy. Uh, is, is that me? No. no. Let's say it is. Oh, it's is not. that is that me? Yes. No, let's say it's Are Nathan. Are you sure? Yes. Let's say it's Nathan so that it can count. It's going to be really funny if it's Nathan, but I'm like 90% sure it's not. <laughs> Come on, get pissed, get angry. Hold on, I'll, 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 I'll sound, some... I'll sound angry first, and then I'll add the jersey on later. Okay. That's there it. Goes. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, that sounds like. I don't know, scum shoe. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm just cool with me. Hey, you well, got come tricked. on, I know you it can. counted the whole time. He's getting really worked up about something. Oh, that's the wrong number! I think he's forging lottery tickets. Oh, looks like an eight would have only netted me five bucks anyway. What a ripoff! What's the problem, Detective Gumshoe? Huh? What's you? Want an ice cream sandwich? How about a yes. whole box of them? Yes. I want a whole box of them. Well, no, you can't have the whole box. I'm, I I just bought a whole box. I'm offering one of them. I will take one of are them. You, and then are you eating more an ice cream you sandwich them in real quick. life right now? I, what? Did you not have a single line for the first half hour of the stream, and then right before you finally got to start talking, you went and grabbed an ice cream sandwich? It always happens. Every always single happens. time. Every single time. It's just, I have no lines, I have no lines, I have no lines. I'm like, I'm hungry, I can afford to grab a snack. And then I grab something, sit down, and then Gumshoe walks on screen. <laughs> Every Jesus. time. All right. To the radio. 
Hey, Detective Dick L. Gumshoe's having lunch here. I also he grabbed... is. Oh, he's having nutty... a twin tea. Salt. I also grabbed a nutty buddy, but like, uh, I didn't think that'd be as funny as Gumshoe with a box of ice cream sandwiches. Is that a real food, <laughs> a nutty buddy? What can I say? Yeah, it's uh. Um, you mean another peanut... butter? No, nutty buddies. They're chalk. Oh, uh, they're uh, they're peanut butter wafers with chocolate over them. Wow, those look it's horrible. It's insane to me that that exists. Have you never had a Nutty Buddy before? No. Uh, I, I mean, I think they're horrible. Well, okay, here's two easy questions. Do you, well, three easy questions. Do you like wafers? Yeah. Do you like peanut butter? Yeah. Do you like chocolate? Yes. Yeah. Do you like Nutty Buddies? That's literally all it is. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> it's also tears. <laughs> that you forgot the blood of the innocent. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I neglected to mention That's where the, the buddies come the from. Otherwise, it's just nutty. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's just a whatchamacallit, but not good whatsoever. It's not this is life. a nightmare. It's literally the meme with the guy where he's like, with with Patrick, you know, I literally walked him through it, and he still said no. How am I supposed to look back in the eye now, pal? You really drove her into a corner, you know. You always blow up on my testimony. Why of all days did you do it today? So, so sorry, there just weren't any holes in it for once. Yeah, what happened? Usually your testimonies are like Swiss cheese. <laughs> oh. Look, don't get so mad at Gumshoe, all right? He was just paying he was just paying extra attention this time. What do you prefer? Crumbly like aged parmesan? Yeah. Ooh, that's a highbrow that, one, Phoenix. That it actually would be back. good. I, I would have liked it. If you brought some crumbly aged parmesan, that would be great. Anyway, this case has already been ruled on. There shouldn't be any holes left to find. So Ooh, did Maggie say anything to you? About me, I mean. View. Well, uh, how did she put it again? Flashback! Holy fuck. Flashback! Something like that. I did not expect the suit actor at Disneyland flashback. That caught me so off guard. P please, Detective Gumshoe, I didn't mean... Where, where, why, why is this happening? Now that, He's banging his head against the wall, Nick. That is the kind of movie grade voice acting that I that I expect. Thanks. Poor Gumshoe. So okay. <laughs> <laughs> You really need to save up enough money for a transcript, pal. I've never, I, you know, I don't have that much money. You shouldn't skip my lines. I was so nervous, my hands were shaking. I hate it when they make the most useful upgrades the most expensive. It's like, yeah, sure, fair enough, but also, fuck you. So how did it taste? Well, for twenty bucks, I guess some. Um, it tasted like I paid 20 bucks. That's a lot of money for a crab head and some spam. It's a little more than that. And a leaf of sour I kind of wish it wasn't, honestly. I kind of wish it was just that one plate. Delicate. But it was a journey, you know? I like when I respond to lines that are spoken. <laughs> you mean you liked it? It didn't taste bad to you? What's the matter with him? Looks like he's thinking. That's it. Time to die. Time to die. I've been <laughs> trying to think of the right word to describe this game. And I just realized <laughs> it's bad. That's it. It tasted bad. I can't remember the last <sighs> time I tasted something bad. I mean, out of the garbage before, and that wasn't that bad. She's kind of hard to admit it to yourself when you pay 20 bucks for it, you know? Maybe you should have found that out with the price after you finished eating. 
<laughs> Keen observational skills, Phoenix. Really on fire today. Hey, Nick. Maybe that's why Glenn Eld came here. <laughs> oh, it's funny. <laughs> maybe he heard about the that was super a good fierce line, twin set. By fierce, you mean fearsome. Be, holy God, I am just, I'm on a fucking bowl. If only people could hear my thoughts. It's okay, I can. I just don't think they're funny. Oh. Oh. Why don't no we ask does. Detective Gumshoe what he knows, oh. seeing as he's here and all? And apparently Godot's oh. also here. I don't, that's that's really new. I'm also I'm here, here. but I'm always God's here. always with us. That checks out. Godot just eats lunch here, I think. You know those, like, um, like, super, like, big meals where, like, it's, like, super expensive, but the if you, like, finish meals. it all in, like, enough time, you just get it for free. <laughs> yeah, like a 50-pound steak oh, or something. Oh, okay, you mean, like, a yeah, thousand Yeah, yeah, yeah. What if this entire restaurant's gimmick is all the food is just, if you finish it in this amount of time, it's free, but they just make it so it's bad that you so can't awful. finish it? It's, like, it's four slices of Spam, a single piece of flan, one beignet, but it's just so shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm like, I'm like, flan. I was like, I was like, so far that sounds like, I, as long as it's not together, that sounded pretty good. Spam's pretty nah, good. It's all, but it's nah. made extremely shittily. No, it's, yeah. it's sandwiched How do you together. make Spam shittily? You can take it you out of the don't pan cook and it. eat it. Oh, yeah, yeah, no. no that, would be, that would be pretty shitty. You can, but like, it's you possible it. to. Like, that's the point of Spam, I thought. Right, but then you have to eat the flan that's like baked with... Uh, you know, fucking like Rated soil. Aged Parmesan cheese. <laughs> with soil. <laughs> and the and the beignet that like isn't powdered with with sugar. It's powdered with fucking flour. Yes. Yeah. Anyway. The flan just has mustard instead of custard. So what were you all excited about earlier, huh? Huh? I really gotta know. <laughs> oh. That's right. You said you were listening to the radio or something, dude. What if you, what if you like, what if you like took a bite out of some flan, and you look, you like this tastes kind of weird. You looked down and it was just meat. <laughs> <laughs> it was just meat, beef, and mustard and ketchup on the inside. <laughs> that would be a layer off flan. Just to yeah. <laughs> there's, there's yeah. still the caramel though, just so it clashes really bad. Yeah. Oh yeah. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that? That was nothing. I wasn't excited. Come on, Detective Gumshoe. You can tell little old me. What were you listening to? N nothing, really. It was just the, um, uh, daily exercise. <laughs> <laughs> really? We're psych locking that? Okay. <laughs> the daily A exercise show! Look at this loser! <laughs> what the fuck is happening? Yeah. Yeah, uh, this lunch special lobster sure is great. Yeah, I totally don't like uh, uh, men. All right, Wait. I'm very confused here, so you I will don't. leave. Oh, uh, I was gonna, a... I was literally, no. I was literally about to say, I think, I think my favorite, like, I, because like you know, usually, usually the bit, usually the bit is you're only here for when Godot's here. So I, I'd like to assume that just uh, the reason you're still here is because the uh, the judge specifically asked for both. Phoenix and Godot to investigate, and Godot's like, oh, yes. fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and he showed up at the law it, office in the morning and was like, it, so it, we doing this? Or? Instead, <laughs> instead, yeah, instead of investigating on his own, since he never fucking investigates on his own, he just fucking follows Phoenix around. <laughs> Just, just I don't. Phoenix walks into his office. He's like, "Wait, why is my door unlocked?" He just sees like Godot watering the plant, and he turns to Phoenix. He's like, "So." I've heard that you've been uh, doing- uh, that you have been neglecting your partner. My partner? Yes, this plant's right here. Charlie. How did you- imagine, how do you know the plant's name? I imagine you walk- you walk into <laughs> it has a the- name tag. You walk into your fucking- your law firm and there's a brick through the window and the door's unlocked. <laughs> there's a, there, there's- there's- there's a- there's a note attached to the brick that just says, Sorry, but your door's lock is too sophisticated, dumbass. Get no, 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 no. Lock. The brick is located outside of the building. He let himself oh. in and then threw the brick outside. Oh, okay. He fucking punched a hole in the wall, <laughs> tore off the plaster, ripped a brick out, and then chucked it through the window. <laughs> and then started watering a plant. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, could you imagine how funny it would be right now if I just 
Tama. Yeah, okay. So I'm gonna get out of here before I discover right. too much information. I don't know what the <laughs> fuck's happening with this. Oh, oh no. He's never seen this, that's right. I've never <laughs> seen this before. I don't but, know this but Naruto I... bullshit. But, but I've <laughs> seen this and this ain't good. Back I don't know I'm what happened. voicing the judge. But I hate <laughs> Judge, what are you doing here? <laughs> you see, oh, we've wrapped right. him in a crystal prison because he doesn't deserve to live. <laughs> All right, Detectivo Gumshia, tell me the truth. What were you listening to? I'm not Shen Lang. No way, I don't pal. Know who that is. Now that you've made a big thing out of it, I'm not gonna lie. It's gonna tell you. That's his name, yeah. right? Who's Shen Lang? Are you Lang? talking about Agent Lang? Agent Lang. It's in his first name. I, I, I think it might be Shen. I'll look into it. Okay. Bro, I don't know who we're talking about. Detective Lang. <laughs> Uh, I don't he's the guy version. who, who like, has she the personality Lang. of Wolverine, but he looks like Wolverine's antagonist. It's, it's she Long Lang, not she Long Lang. I see. What the fuck are you guys talking about? <laughs> this guy can play... <laughs> Investigations, there we go, I finally got it. It's true, I didn't. You should have been. We were all playing it with oh you Oh my god, you're right, he does look time. like Sabretooth. Well, I'm not going to jump into investigations. A trial in. It's probably how far you guys have gotten, right? Uh, two trials. This yeah. is the trial three we're on right now. Yeah, we've been Oh my in god, I actually wasn't that far off. Months. That's crazy. What do you mean? It's only five trials. It's hard to be far off. <laughs> Hold on, I have to be funny real quick. <laughs> how funny? Uh, kind of funny. Okay. Leo Whitefang? Yeah. Yeah. Considering he all the noise you were making, he's kind of like Leo Whitefang. I don't know it's much about Leo Whitefang, but program. like what little I do know, he's actually eerily close to Leo Whitefang. Exactly. I cannot believe that I actually predicted that. Wait, why did they add the fucking testimony way back here? What? <laughs> Alright, whatever. Good point. I'm right, aren't I? You were listening to the lottery results, weren't you? You thought you'd try to win big, just like Glen Elk did. It's... It's like you can see right through me. Uh, what next? I've... You're gonna Crack tell me already? that ever since the stock crashed that, that you knew they've been paying us in lottery tickets? See, pal? That's why I said it was nothing. I'm just waiting. For to like for like sixteen more to appear. <laughs> Gumshoe actually. Are you serious? Gumshoe actually hides. Okay, to like... what the fuck is happening right now? What is this trial? <laughs> <laughs> had a cry. I've had a fucking entire witness who added nothing. <laughs> there were there were Cyclops in the last trial, right? I'm not crazy. No, there were. I, I think so. I don't know. I think. Well, so. What even I, was I the last trial? Last trial. <laughs> oh my god. It's we like a distant memory. Like... Uh, was that the one where it was Ronda Light 2 Electric Boogaloo? Oh my god, that's right, I think. Yeah, it was Ronda Light, yeah. it was Mask to Mask. Yeah, it was. Yeah, yeah, there was a ton of Psychlox then. Was there? I don't remember. Yeah, there were a ton of them, dude. <laughs> I don't even Luke remember investigating Luke at me had anything. so many locks alone. But wasn't that in the first one, though? No. The first? Because no. he was also in the in the first Ronda Light one. I feel like the, I feel like the second trial was like just trial i don't think well, was no, no, no actually actually it was in the first one because we didn't talk to luke at me at all in the second run to light one because he was being tried as master mask so no we, yeah because so the second trial took place in one lost. day yeah What do you got to say to that, Andrew? Uh, I, I don't have anything to say. I feel Mr. like Smart every guy. memory that I have about this series is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What's with everyone in the lottery? So, how did it go? I won 50 cents. That Holy is... Shit. Wow, you can't even buy a ticket with that. That's possible? Damn. It'd be better to win nothing at all than half a lousy buck. I was so mad. Yeah, I know the feeling. 
bought the same kind of ticket as Mr. Elk, see? And they've got this special radio show where they announce the winning numbers. They even do li the drawings live on air. It's intense, pal. There's this guy with the stitches down his face, very butler-like. Does all the that's what Mr. Elk was listening to on the day he was killed. Yeah, I sort of figured that was a given. That's why he crossed out the 100,000, because he thought he was going to win, then he heard his numbers and it was not. Yeah, but then why did he write MC Bomber next to it? Because he was going to MC kill somebody. Hmm, that's possible. Why is Master Mask on there? Oh, uh, just for a, for a laugh. Uh, hey, what time is it? Oh, uh, it's just after 180. And are the lottery results always broadcast at the same time? Yeah, look, I got this flyer when I bought the ticket. Experience the most thrilling 10 minutes of your life every Monday at 1.30 p.m. Millionaire Radio? That sounds cool. I want to try it, Nick. Maya would totally be the kind of person to win the lottery in a way where that's, like, linchpin evidence for why she committed a murder. It hasn't... It hasn't been a week, has it? Since he died? Wasn't it like a month? Yeah, no. it's been... No, it's been what? a while. I remember it being like... Oh, oh yeah! Because oh, there's, right, the there's been a there's whole the other trial. I yeah. forgot. <laughs> Which, I mean, I don't think it's as much as a month. Because usually the judge is like, I'm sick of this shit after like three days. <laughs> well, there was like it's because it's, it it's cause Maggie is not being held in detention. Maggie is full on like arrested. In prison. Yeah. I'm gonna examine that fucking coffee stain because it looks old and stinky. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, it's yeah. not just coffee. I guess it's stinky because of this that. police tape around it. And you know yeah, how police stain are in their tape. Poison coffee. Hey, Maya, you should um. Should look the tablecloth again. Okay, That's a great idea. That's a really great idea. I am a cat girl, you know. I can picture you doing just that. <laughs> All right. Well, this is uh. You know, I have a. a Phoenix Wright and Co. They will make you say nya. That is they their will. motto. Here at the Wright Comma oh, and shit. Co. Hey. Law offices. Did you guys know January seventh, trust behind in the kitchen, huh? 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 Mr. Armstrong's talking to someone? Holy fuck, I totally uh -huh. forgot about those blue vials. What the Me fuck too. are those? It's where you got the bottle of poison. Holy shit, it's a character I don't recognize and don't know who voices. I think me. <laughs> Give me a second, I'm not at all. Alright. It's How either- is somebody with head trauma sound? I've never I met somebody with head trauma before. Next month. Oui, natural net, I will be waiting for you. Um, you stop looking at me like that. Then, I'm afraid it might get a little hot around here. Are you with the mafia? Lean your, lean Come on, I will have everything ready, I promise. I love the <gasps> fire, you know. I love the way it crackles. Stop it. Okay, so stop voice acting her so well. Stop. She's just oh, mad father um, killer care villain. No. Stop it! I beg you. Um, don't let me down. I'll be watching you. Mace, no, this, this is not necessary. You can't trust me, Mademoiselle. Holy fuck. Talk to anyone, and I'll drive a knife right through your heart. So it sucks. No, I'm not you a cop you don't have to worry. You know you worry far too much. But maybe this will help you relax. It is all of the sandals. I do love raw meat. What a weird I'm fucking jump, down. dude. Nobody was talking about raw meat. <laughs> oh. I'll be taking my leave. Goodbye for now. We just okay, saw bye. the battle of the century. The gays versus the lesbians. The shit? Oh, look, I have your shivers. I must run some of my oil all over my body before I become the nervous wreck. 
Zero. Oh, wee oui, wee. Oui. That feels good. Uh, um. <laughs> oh la la. Excuse me, monsieur. Oh, oh god. Oh, sweet mother. All right. If you have trouble with your eyes, you need this. The oil of sandalwood. You want me to put oil on my eyes? It's how I get my eyes so shiny, don't you know? I don't, I don't want my eyes to look like brown M&Ms, thank you. <laughs> Why not? You don't, uh, you don't have that many customers, do you, huh? No, you're right, monsieur. But perhaps that is the perfect time for you to visit me now. Oh, that way I can give you my undivided attention and cook you la dish supreme. Special for you. I hate it here. That's what girls do, Nick. What? What do girls know. do? I actually wasn't paying attention. Oh, you are right! <laughs> girls do indeed do that. Business is very difficult these days. I, I was paying attention, and I the only thing I she could possibly be responding to was that he wanted to make me a meal. Is Maya <laughs> sexist? I, I don't know. Maybe. She was thinking what do you mean you don't? Either, what do you mean so you don't know? You are Maya. I, I wasn't listening. I just wanted to say a random sentence. People don't know. Oh my understand. god. My, Maya is sexist is, and um, doesn't listen. Trey. I just wanted people to uh, think that my restaurant was exclusive. But they, but they think you just serve plastic f uh, fast food on cheap plastic trays. Nick, that's the kind of thing that can make a girl cry. Maya, what the fuck are you talking about? I'm sorry, I've been staring into your eyes Mr. because Armstrong you made a little a brown M&M &M thing. Uh, oh. oh god, this is... This is Japanese game being very Japanese right now. But this restaurant is my life. It is everything to me. I will defend it to la finale. No one will take it from me. I will take it from you. So who was that woman you were just talking to? Clearly oh la la, you saw that. Yeah, I, 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 yes, I, uh, sorry for everyone. So, who was she? She looked so polite and great, graceful. Of course Maya would be into her. Polite? Graceful? And she likes raw meat and fires, right? Those can both make hamburgers if they're put together. Oh, oh yes, we needed this flashback. This is good. <laughs> we flashback. really did. Flashback. For you, Maya, in particular. Oh, thank you so much. Got it. That flashback? Okay. Back to this character. You're welcome, Maya. Got it. <laughs> no. Got to see flashback. We'll upset flashback. the time one. Yes, the time. Okay, back to back to Armstrong. Say flashback. flashback. Good job. Thank you. Now that I think about it. <laughs> Hey, Maya, I think it's pretty clear what kind of conversation they were having. You think so? Well, then let's show them that piece of evidence and see what happens. You gotta be more specific than that. You're right. I actually don't know what I'm talking about again. I'm still I, trying to nobody... figure out what your eye color is because it's supposed to be brown and or gray and or blue depending on the game. And I really can't tell what, what what's how you're going to make your eyes look like brown M&Ms by spraying with a gre uh, blue bottle of oil. I mean, it doesn't I guess make sense maybe to me. poison? I don't... Oh no, is she talking about the lottery ticket? Yeah. Well, no. No. No, I- oh, wait, I'm- wait, why- oh, I have to present. Not the lottery ticket, Michael? Are you sure? Just present everything. I'm gonna present the lottery ticket. What are you gonna do awesome. about it, Mike? If only I had taken the right lottery ticket. I would not have any debts right now, and I would be free. Look on the bright side, Mr. Armstrong. You want a dollar, right? That's twice Black as much as Gumshoe. It wasn't a lot. Mike, Michael, why didn't you stop me? <laughs> you have control. You could have Here. taken it away from Here, me. Here, you want me? You want me to? <laughs> oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> Voice activity so is back on. So long exists, I am but a delightful angel with a broken wing. An angel? Huh? Might as well just Doesn't say, God, well take the wheel. Think about it. What? Big wheel? My favorite Marvel character? I mean, oh. it's a classic quote, Jesus take the wheel. Oh, Jesus we take the wheel. Take hip the rest and me month after month. And say, I, 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 I agree to welcome. 
Help them? Help them with what? My Spencer, if I did not owe the, um, the money, I would have refused. But uh, my hands were tied. What did you agree to help them with? None, I cannot say. If I tell you that woman, she would slice me up. Oh, and... Like the pig on the roast. And eat me with a salad garnish. You would not be a salad, sir. <laughs> salad I hope garnish. It doesn't mean that alert would be slapped up. Why would you serve not a salad with a salad garnish? What? Meat is perfect to garnish for salad. No! Meat what? is a perfect garnish for salad. It's not a garnish at that point, it's just an ingredient. Yes! You can't garnish something with meat. Yes! You, yeah. you serve meat with a garnish of vegetables, which is why it's a salad gar garnish. Yes, it's the reverse. Yes, you are correct. I don't know what Phoenix is talking about. Oh. What the fuck? What? <laughs> it's a salad garnish. It's like you put like a, a fucking asparagus or something on top. It's a garnish or a something. Salad garnish know. is like a little bit of cheese, some fucking no. berries. What? Yeah. No. It's a fucking little. It's a little. I hey, was, there's a fucking a thing I'm on the top. I was with you till you said berries. You can put berries, yeah, berries on the salad. Berries and Not at the same time. Well, well actually, why not? I mean, fruit, salads, fruit and cheese is there. like. A garnish is just an together. extra little it's accent. It's like a decoration. Thing. Yeah. Yeah. So you put a vegetable. Vegetables go in salads. So you put a vegetable on top, and it's a garnish. That's a vegetable. That's a salad. That is that's not a salad what a garnish. salad garnish. A salad is garnish a salad is garnish a garnish for a salad. Okay. You do not put a salad garnish on meat. You put a meat garnish. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you just put a garnish on meat? No. Or a garnish put... on salad. Why? Why? No. You, you put a little Batman. Salad? You put a little Batman statue on the meat. <laughs> that goes in my calzones, Nick. No. No, when you make the Batman calzone, you extract the essence of Batman from the statue and you put it into the sauce. If you wanted to garnish a Batman calzone, you put you take a little branding thing with, in the shape of a bat logo and you press it uh, right on. As God, I declare that to be funny as hell. So uh, it's true now. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, God. Thanks for taking my side, like always. All right, whatever. I'm gonna guess that woman has something to do with your loan contract. <laughs> oh. <laughs> with your five hundred thousand dollars in debt loan contract. She's a landlord. You know, I I think I take back everything positive that's said about her. Hope she dies. No, she, she's just who they send to collect culinary school loans. Oh, that might be. Better. She's a student loan collector. Yeah. Are you gonna voice the... your line, Nathan? He probably did. He might have, but he I didn't might hear have, it. But, uh... let, let, let me try again. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's good enough for me. <laughs> good. How am I just now noticing how dirty this fucking kitchen is? Andrew Armstrong, <laughs> tell us about that woman. <laughs> the woman just now. The woman who was here earlier, I take it that she's, um... Um... Uh, why is it come to this? What a tragedy! Suddenly I find myself so deep in the dead. It is a sign of the bad, bad world we live in, huh? All you had to do was not take a loan from the Magia to support a failing restaurant. That's all you had to do. Oh, wait until you- wait until you see the name of the loan company. So oh shit, it's really is it yeah. Lone Sharks Incorporated? Woman. She is from the loan office. <laughs> loan office, okay. By office, do you mean back room of a laundromat? No, uh, an alphabet soup company. Oh, Tender Lender. Yeah, it's on the fucking, it's on the uh, contract. Tender Lender, it's called. Yeah, I, yeah, I laughed out loud during the trial the when I saw that. All the alphabet soup in the country. You cannot find alphabet soup anywhere else. Just, Just hearing it makes me want to borrow some money. Maya, Maya. Please, you must not borrow from them if you must no more than ten dollars. Ten dollars? Sounds like your whole monthly stipend, Maya. <laughs> Another banger, <laughs> Phoenix. I know. Classic Phoenix, and it's he doesn't yep. pay me shtick.
That I exactly. get a bit more than that. Thank it's you funny because it's true. Wink, wink. <laughs> oh, so says you, but I balance the books. <laughs> No, so don't. tender lender is Charlie right, does. Don't. Yeah, it's true. So tender lender is the loan office you borrowed half a million from, huh? Charlie is the <laughs> only one of the three who knows any math. I wonder well, if he's he got green. anything to do with this case. It's because he's green. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Say it. Say it. Damn, no. is, Arm is Armstrong is canon? Is that canon? Yeah. No, it's because of Japanese stuff. Uh, what the fuck does that mean? Uh, in <laughs> Japan, uh, they haven't really distinguished um, transness and gayness as much as we have. They mix them up a lot. This was and also associate them ago. as being somewhat synonymous. Yeah, this was, again, this was also 20 years ago. Yeah. This was 20 years ago? Almost, yeah. almost. I think this particular one was 2004. When was this? What is this game called? Trials Trial and Tribulations? Trials and completely wrong. But I think, yeah, Trials and Tribulations was 2004. Yeah, King yeah, Trials and Tribulations, 04. And I am upset. It's 19 years old. Nice you, yeah. Armstrong, please. We are discussing history. I am so just for just for just a reference, in California, gay marriage was legalized four years later. In two thousand and eight. In California. In California, it's, also, it's uh, still not legal in Japan, technically. It's um also why he okay, probably has a lot of thing. rose iconography. Because um the word for uh, well that they used to use for gay people back then is aura which is not a Well, hey, you can't say that. <laughs> it means bros. What the fuck? Why are there 55 new messages? Oh my god, John got Denji. Yeah, he did. Peace. I was gonna claim it and then didn't feel like it. He got Denji? Oh, I he got Denji. I, literally, the exact I same thing happened to me. I saw forever. Denji and I was like, yeah, I'm good. Oh my god, this fucking guy. <laughs> oh, dude, the Deku Baba? Oh, hey, I got a key. On. All right. Now. Oh, okay. Oh, he's rolling, yeah. man. Don't worry, I might switch it up in the middle. Uh -huh. um, Frankie Stein. Wait, Fra wait Frankie. What? Wait, wait, wait. What? Wait, what? How did I roll? Oh, wait, Frankie hold on, Stein? a goddamn. Hey, it's six doctor. A <laughs> six. They Frankie probably Stein. have no gender. Oh yeah, no, they. Uh, Which would be based. But yeah. the show is called. Well, I guess it. Never mind. It's, wait, it's Nathan, stop real quick. Nathan, stop real quick. Nathan, stop real quick. Actually, never mind. Oh, oh. Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't stop. Oh, my oh. <laughs> I was trying to stop you so I could like see what, what the claim timer was at. <laughs> and then I saw yeah, Camilla and I'm like... Huh, Frankie yeah, Stein is generous. Yeah, there was, there was like a whole song they did about her pronoun being they then and stuff, so I checked that. Oh, neat. Did you know? That's pretty cool. I, I didn't expect that because that show was like... They, them. I did the thing, I did the meme, guys. years old or something? The pronouns are they, them? What's, what's the meme? I said her pronouns are they them. Oh, I see. Oh, I'm going to, <laughs> as a member of the non-binary race, I am going to have to summarily execute you, uh, Andrew. Oh, that's that's fair. <laughs> Wait, well, while we're, while we're on the topic of Monster High, I know that my chat can't see this and I'm too lazy to put it up, but I'm just going to post, like, because my sister used to be, like, really big uh, Monster High fan, so this is my, this is my favorite one. Rebecca, Rebecca Steam. Rebecca Steam. Rebecca Steam. Please that's elaborate. Fun. That's fair. <laughs> just, well, that's it's the... Rebecca, but with robe like a robot. And then Steam, because she's steampunk. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to put my dishes at the sink. I'll be back. You are <laughs> a disgrace. What are you I talking am? about? That is a Phoenix Wright name, dude. That is that. It's a Phoenix Wright name. <laughs> That is a bad Phoenix right now. <laughs> okay. Robocus. You got it. You got it. I, won't deny, I won't deny that that's the level of quality some Phoenix right names are at, but it is the bad Phoenix right I think you. I think you have to understand that's just monster high names in general. Laguna <laughs> Blue. Bonita Femur. <laughs> but yeah, Bonita Femur. Claudine Wolf. There's a character oh. named Draculaura. 
They just took Dracula Jackson and Jekyll. put Raw. Hurts. Dude, they didn't even I, fucking try with Jackson that, Jekyll. That 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 would be a show that you could torture me with. That would torture me. I would hate. That. Why? Dude, Jackson Jekyll makes Nintendo videos. He does. No, he, he looks like a guy <laughs> who'd make fucking. Where's Where's Hyde? Hail. There, Jackson right. Jekyll. You know what? I'll say they they actually tried on Hyde. His name is Holt Hyde, which is actually kind of cool. Holt Hyde. Why is he so no, hot? No. I refuse. I refuse to believe Holt Hyde exists. Jekyll is actually Hyde, and and then his normal version is just Scott the Walls. I don't like Holt. Okay, why? No, why is Holt Hyde so hot, dude? This is a, this is a, a serious deviation from the source material. It's kind of spitting in the face of everything uh, uh, I was meant to be. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I just saw. I just saw. Hold voodoo. On. I, gotta go to Monster High well, I saw voodoo, voodoo. I got. I like. I gotta look at this. My chat is like. My, my non-existent chat is just like. <laughs> why is Holt Hyde? <laughs> Why is no, that is a guy named Hoodoo Voodoo. Uh, who who is this Hoodoo. character who is literally just named the River Sticks? Yeah, that, that's <laughs> that's definitely a. a it's... It's... Oh, this is Hades. Venus McFly Trap. <laughs> that's awesome. No, that one's awesome. <laughs> I'd party with Venus McFly Trap. <laughs> okay. Anyways. Ghoulia, no, dude, Ghoulia yelps. Who's Ghoulia? I, 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 I'm Out of all the lines to keep on screen during this oh. segment. <laughs> yeah, it's a... I don't even. Yeah, her character design is annoying, but Ghoulia yelps is a great name. Alright, anyways, can we move on? <laughs> Uh, I suppose. Now that, now that we've done that, we've... still hasn't actually read the line. I consumed the whole ping I in the have time for the, uh, read the line. Yeah. Yeah. I don't yeah. believe you, but I'm gonna move on. Uh, time for me to do a complete 180 on the voice. <coughs> Thanks to Thanks him, loaning, to him me. loaning me the money. I've... What the no, fuck? I can't do it. I can't fucking do it. Uh, the, the words are too weird. Doing an Ursula impression is too difficult. What the shit? Supposed to be. This is not Ursula, bro. Gene Armstrong is not Ursula. Eh. Eh. It was the first thing I thought of when I was first thinking, eh, what voice should I do for him? I could do an Ursula kind of thing. The first Gene Armstrong is like an insecure Corella Deville, but he is not Ursula. Insecure <laughs> Corella Deville. No, no, I don't think so. Ursula, I mean, Corella Deville is like, um, Corella Deville likes to like skin puppies for fun. I don't think uh -huh. Armstrong would ever do that. What? He's selling Ursula snake oil. Is it's just, not that far. Ursula is literally just the artist saw uh, a famous person in drag and was like, I'm gonna make a villain with a design like that. Yeah. You know she is based off of a drag stuff, right? That makes sense. Yeah. Both the voice and the design. Sure. Still haven't read the line. Thanks to him loaning me the money, I have to pay back up. dollars now. My, my brain can't try to do an impression and also translate his words into English. It's impossible. <laughs> I am like his slave. I have to do everything that he tells me. Let's put it through text to speech. Uh, who is this he? I gotta know. El Tigre. I'm so, uh, El Tigre? El Tigre. The, the El Tigre? From Nickelodeon <laughs> fame? The, no. <laughs> he is La Manager, the Tenderland. A terrifying man, the big city monster. When he Why do you shouts sound... at me, my knees are trembling. Why? And okay. His voice no, is ringing you cannot do this to me. Days. You cannot go from terrified to seductive as soon as you bring up <laughs> no, no, the no, fucking no, guy no. who's been holding your life hostage. No, 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 That's no, no, no. It's, it's been very clearly he's terrified when he's talking about the woman, but he's not when he's talking about the guy. Yeah. 
This Don't is the first time he's talked feelings? about the guy. Yes, and I'm being very consistent about how he's talking about the guy. Consistent? This is the yeah. first time! Yeah, all yeah. one time he's done the same thing. That's what I call consistency. Oh yeah. my god. <laughs> it's, it makes no sense. As soon as I hear the noise, I said, that adult scooter, you right? Scooter! Scooter! Wee woo wee woo! Scooter! <laughs> Big city mobster who rides a battered old scooter. Uh, 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 does this guy resemble me by any chance? Oh, no, 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 no. This man has a It was a simple question. It was a simple question. It, no, it, it was a simple question. Yes or no? Well, I said no three times. You said no three times. Among other things, have the spike I just wanted, air, just I like wanted you. just a yes and or no. The I didn't need to get roasted. Hedgehog. All right. The shop. You didn't need to bring up the character. All we, right. There's a resemblance there, I suppose. You do have his. Don't side block me, man. Hmm. Sounds like this loan office is roguish. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it is worth checking out after all. I, I like, I like, I like that pause of you just start sinking into your thoughts and you're like, wait, roguish charm. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to visit Santander, uh, it is just beyond Vitamin Square. Oh fuck. Hey Nick. Back to there. <laughs> if you need money, I can loan you some as long as it's less what? than three dollars. Well, um, well thanks for the offer. How are you doing? Well, no. Still not as broke as Gumshoe. Alright. Oh, hi. Speak of the devil. Bye. Hey. <laughs> Hello, January 7th, Vitamin Square. Hmm. I don't see any sign of Mr. Kudo, do you? Maybe he went to buy another ton of bird seed. I was kind of hoping he wouldn't be here anyway. At least not for now. Besides, any more seeds today, and I'm liable to turn into a real phoenix. Blip, blip. The tender length. You know, you were on a roll. <laughs> it's the dead silence. Just take, I'm taking it in. <laughs> oh shit. Oh man. Wow. This is a lot. Is that a too. solid gold desk? You should go inside and find out. Yeah, I don't it's really like, want uh... to. It's like the budget version of uh, Red White's room. Dude, even that CD is gold. Yeah, it's like the budget version of Red White's room. But the phone is like 12 years robe. old. Huh? The King's robe is funny. <laughs> the like neon pink King's robe. Yeah. I like the uh, the replica of Phoenix's jacket in the back. <laughs> oh yeah, true. Yeah, it's Didn't even got the, the metal. The attorney's too. badge. Yeah. The January seventh. Tender lender. I like this the place hot gives pink, off a really uh, strange vibe, doesn't it? Looks like uh, the tigre isn't in his lair, and that is, as they say, a very good thing. Oh, is that him? How many characters are left? No, like... I'll tell you, uh, Nathan. This is this is the mystery girl. Okay, oh, thanks. Welcome. Oh my god. Hola! Yo soy Phoenix. <laughs> You're here to discuss alone? No! <laughs> <laughs> the manager is away at the moment. Wait quietly, please. Okay. <laughs> She's gone just like that. I guess we'll just no, have to okay, come back another time. But this is the perfect opportunity, Nick. Well, it's not a Japanese word either, but they still say it. <laughs> this place reeks of suspicion. Come on, Nick, let's take a look around, all right? Do you think it'd be okay? Of course. No one will ever know. Coffee. No! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I'll leave it here for you to enjoy quietly. Gracias! Do not touch the desk, please. Adios! Nick, let's get.
get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm looking around. Is that my jacket? Hey, nope. look at this per 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 mm -hmm. the coat. It's so chic. It's more like a please don't coat say that's chic. I don't know. I, guess I haven't got words. an eye for fashion. I, I I hope that like my voice is coming through the way I want it to because hey, I can this. just. It has been. Okay, cool. For once. This suit is the same color as the one you ne uh, wear, Nick. Yeah, it's a couple sizes bigger, though. Keep your ah! voice down, Maya. I'm sorry. Shut up. Nick, you've got to take a look at this. Oh, shit. Some cake? No. <laughs> no tenemos hambre! No tenemos hambre! <laughs> I don't know. No. <laughs> sure, I guess. You have plenty, I see. I'll just leave it here for you. I don't think it was hombre. I think I got the wrong word, Nick. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure, thanks. Gracias, said, I mean. He said, I don't have a man. <laughs> That's not <laughs> what I meant to say! <laughs> I think if you spell it differently, it's... Yeah, yeah, no, no, it is hombre. Yes, I got it right. Yes, yes, just yes. Just wait here. Quietly. Otherwise... Sure. Did you hear that, Nick? Wait quietly, she said. See. <laughs> <laughs> I have my eye on you. Only so I can take care of you. Oh, hombre. I thought you said hombre. Understand? Ah, I'm scared, Nick, but I gotta keep my voice down. So, what were you getting so excited about before? I don't remember. Look, on the lapel of the suit. Oh, good, you remember. Holy that's, shit, hi, John. That's an attorney's badge. Godot, what are you doing here? Godot. Godot, get the fuck out! Godot! It's a stealth it's operation! I saw, I saw Spanish in the chat! Is El Tigre <laughs> a lawyer? ¿Qué? ¿Qué tiene hambre aquí? No, no! Shut the fuck up! Look at this thing! It's made of paper! I can't look! I'm playing guilty gear! I assume Papel? So no, go to that! Go to that! You're supposed to be investigating! Why are you playing guilty gear? <laughs> this shit's fun as fuck! <laughs> For some reason, your badge looks really cheap next to this one, Nick. What the fuck? Why doesn't anyone recognize an obviously fake badge when they see one? God, so much disrespect. Ooh, what music are they playing? There's a CD player on the desk, but the desk is so loud, it's a wonder you can hear it. <laughs> it's Bob 48! That's oh, that's the best one. I wonder which one he's into, because, you know, it's, there's so many genres present in this. Same girl. It's the same girl? Yeah. <laughs> she, you know, she, doesn't get, uh, she doesn't get name drops till the end of the chapter, so you're gonna uh, have... Uh, not chapter, well, not chapter, so you're gonna be stuck with the question marks for a while. You can tell by the ellipses. Yeah. Andrew, why'd you, have to, name, line, why'd you have to drop a kids bop that doesn't exist? I'm sorry. There's no kids bop 48. You've. I was so excited to look up a random kids bop and see what was on it, and you have. Okay, go with kids bop four then. My plan. Okay, this is 2004. Four. Go with kid. No, kids, kids bop yeah. four. Kids bop four has all of the best ones. You I think just, it has you both just do all not respect me at and all, bring you? me to life. This is the worst. Kids Bop 4 is the best one. Unless I'm thinking of two, in which case I'm sorry. Let me look up the track list for both. Oh, Kids Bop 4. Skater Boy, Jenny from the Block, Miss Independent, Ooh, Bring Me to Life, Beautiful, The Bring Anthem, life, yeah. Game of Love. Underneath it all, When I'm Gone, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna, gonna Get, get You good. good. Oh, God! Crimey River, River, No Letting Go, Intuition, Move It Like This, Angel, right. I Do Anything, The Catch-Up Song, Hi, and I The Middle. Only me right now. I'm gonna be I'm honest with sure. you, I Maybe only know Skater everyone. Boy in the middle. Considering the voice meter's still going, I'm just making her everyone. Never mind. What? My joke doesn't work anymore. What are you, what are you talking about, bro? No, nothing happened. I definitely didn't, um, trip over my desk and unplug my headphones. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna start playing Kids Bob. Kids Bob right. One songs. I think I think All Star was on the very first one. I think they debuted with All Star. Yeah, there it is. They debuted oh my God. with All Stars. Sixteen yep. and thirty-two. Smash, smash, they have Dude, why they make the guitar on Skater Boy like sound so fucking muddy? I I fully recommend the Kids Bob version of Bring Me to Life. I think it's an all-time classic. 
Okay, Andrew. All right. Ah! Yeah, uh, thanks. It was, it was mucho good. <laughs> mucho good. Oh, you trinkets. All? <laughs> Gulp sound effect. <laughs> If you touch anything else that doesn't belong to you, there's always another cup. What did you give me? What did it? It was I laced with you? something. I'm almost sure of it. Nick, my stomach is killing me. Ah! The Damn. strongest. Maybe I, can... <laughs> I can't believe you just ignored my Oh wait, maybe it was just the burger I ate for breakfast. I really hope. So. Jimmy Dean. The strongest laxatives is known to man. Your pants will take a look at the CD. Your pants will become brown in the next ten minutes. What? It's not the Rocco's Modern Life soundtrack, is it? Cl cl uh, by Eye of the Spider. The clitoris of the tiger. Whoa! 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 I don't remember Maggie Let's telling us Let's listen to it. I bet it's heavy metal. Do. No way. That woman will make us drink of more, more coffee if we do. A simple disc with a name written in marker. All right. Time to look at this sick-ass ashtray. Oh, This oh, version no. of Skater Boy sucks. Somebody's dude. dead. That's going to be oh. a nightmare to clean up. Yeah, it's all over the rug and everything. I accidentally knocked over a really big space heater once. Cleaning up was such a pain. What? Did I say into instead of over? My bad. It was one of those super antiques where you have to burn a ton of charcoal. What the? You Did you knock over a fucking train car? <laughs> yeah, I bumped into it and it was just boom. Like a this cow. Is... What the? Oh, hey! There's a book of matches here, too. Mmm, matches, huh? Places don't give those out much nowadays. Hey, wait a second! What is it? Look what's printed on it. Trace Bien. Oh. These matches could come in handy. I've solved the puzzle. Yeah. They were smoking buddies. The pilot uh, light perhaps. for the office boiler <laughs> keeps going out. Okay, I'm gonna stop listening to Kip's Bot 4, because this hurts. <laughs> Go ahead. As you should. It's just bring me to life that matters. Everything else, I won't even bother. Although Skater Boy's probably good. Haven't heard it. That, no, that shit good. was awful. <laughs> it was. It was so bad. How could the Kids Bop version of Skater Boy possibly be bad? I think the question, how could the Kids Bop version of blank possibly be bad, is one that should just never enter a person's mind. <laughs> you think Kids Bop did a cover really? of Stacy's mom? Wait, no, it's not is right. He... No, it's no, they right. did a cover it, of Peaches, so they could it, do anything. Okay. Look, the, the problem <laughs> Damn, really? that makes yeah. that thought so bad is that it's almost correct, in that the thought should be, how they could a stuff. insert Kids Bop song here be good? That's the real thought. They... That's... Yeah, that's the real question. All right, I'm listening to Peak right now. Anyone want to join me in the Discord call? No. Uh, no. I don't. I did they? Can't. Did they I do what? Did they do? Which is my kids. Bob. Did they do? Did they do? Dear Maria. Did they? Dude, they have to. Have... I don't even know I, what that is. Bro. I literally. You don't know Dear Maria? Oh, uh, that's a classic. Yeah. Whenever that plays at my work, it's it's I got over. I got your picture. I'm coming with I'm coming you. With Dean, oh, that song. Yeah. Uh, they have not done that. Okay. Yeah. No. <laughs> I'm gonna have this song. I've never known the name of that song. It's Dear Maria. Count me in. Yeah, it's Dear well, Maria. I, parentheses. Yeah, I sort of figured it out, parentheses. But... Count me in. It's Dear Maria, comma. Count me in. Fake I'm fan so of sorry. Theory. I didn't gotta, verbally say the fan. punctuation. Yeah, well, Michael dared to say parentheses, so I was correcting him. Oh, yeah. Anyways. Maya, did you did you hit the ball? Uh, yeah, and I think I swinged and missed it. That means you didn't- that means you didn't hit the ball. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I was not- I wasn't ready. Wow, this is a lot of screaming. <laughs> it's- <laughs> Oh, it's done. 
Wait, why is their version of Peach ah! is only a minute and a half long? The original is only a minute and a half long. It's two. It's three minutes long. I like how the quote is. Peaches by presidents of the America, or presidents of the United States of America. <laughs> no, no. By Bowser. What the fuck? Voiced was by this? by Jack Black in the Super Mario oh, Brothers movie twenty twenty three. I forgot that that happened. I thought we were talking about the the classic Peaches. No, that's why you should have joined me. Maybe you would have gotten the joke faster. Look, since I have to, I'm gonna be listening to this on loop until we leave this office. Oh, that's uh, awful. I'm so unfortunately, sorry. I can't. Maya, come up from under the desk. What are you two snooping around in my office for? Um, no, no, we were, uh, you- uh, OH MY PRECIOUS CARPET, YOU'S GOT ASH ON MY RUG! That was staring at- if you look at the cameras- YOU GONNA WISH YOUR UGLY FEET NEVER CAME TO MY DOOR! Like, it wasn't us, alright, it was already like- that. YOUS WANNA ARGUE WITH ME?! IS THAT WHAT YOU'RE DOING?! YOU THINK YOUS CAN TAKE ME ON! I'm gonna well, plan. Legally, I'm gonna plan you to imp into pancakes and turn you into my new rugs. That's highly illegal, sir. Ah. No. No, anything but that. Nathan. Metaton Tigre, you're back. You say Metaton Tigre? I will eat your feet. <laughs> I, I didn't say that at all. Oh, I, I thought that's what you said. The line. I thought I heard that. Uh. Ow. That voice, it's like evil seeping into your head through your ears. Go away. Demon. I'm so sorry, Don Tigre. I knocked over that ashtray earlier and... Okay, well, she, she's gonna fucking die. Oh, right. Huh? Uh, forget, forget about it, Atlanta. It's, it's none. What the fuck is going on? I ain't gonna get mad at you. You're too cute, you hear? Uh, cute? She threatened to murder a guy earlier? Well, isn't it, it, ad isn't it adorable? He about? Here, have some cookies. I just baked them. After I wouldn't do that, Don Tigre. And you'll need some Strong espresso. That's not espresso. While you're discussing your loan. I think that is dark chocolate mixed with ash. Oh, that was, that was Phoenix right. Uh, yeah, doodles. You was either crazy or just plain stupid to chase after me. I worked so hard, but now you gotta come and mess up my plan. So it was him. He's my phony. <laughs> but I don't care. No one gets in my way. Wait, you think you can just steal my haircut, and and you can you can get away with me? I mean, get away with you get get. Uh, oh, I shut the book up. You should read your line. You should have left the little girl at home, right? Uh, I have a few things to. Oh. oh okay, this is a lot. Ah. No questions. This is the last time we meet. Okay, bye. Right, wait, hold on a sec, just please, just- And he's gone. That was pretty weak, Nick. Pathetic, and even. You waited until he was out of your shot before you shot it after him. I, I didn't- I didn't hear you saying anything except, ah. Uh. <laughs> That's true. And I said it differently every time. The espresso. She's dead, I've got- Still adding letters, the word ah! right in front of her, just still adding letters. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And cookies. What kind? What it kind of cookies? It's important. Come on. What kind of cookies? Violetta. What, what kind of cookies you... are they, Violetta? What kind of cookies do you think they are? I don't know. You tell me. Mega What kind of cookies? Red are? velvet. Red, red velvet. You see, I get why Michael's not joining me because he's the host of the stream and all he needs doesn't want to uh, get DMCA'd. And I get why Nathan can't because he literally can't. But Jeremy, why are you not joining me? <laughs> why am I not joining you for Peaches covered by Kids Bop Kids in 2023? On, on loop. Oh, gee. Oh, gee. Oh, the greatest scientific minds will be wondering for centuries to come. All um, I'm saying I'll is that it is you to ponder it on your own. It, oh, so says you. Um, uh, listen, so I'm kind of okay, curious about your company, Dinner 
with the warm and friendly atmosphere you'd expect from a disguised business. In a flash. A conscientious rate of interest and an attractive repayment policy. Why are you, wait, what? When did you start selling me on a loan? We will tenderly lend you that little bit extra here at Tender Lender. Ah, I see what you did there. That was not clever. Hey, Nick, things are a bit tight for Wright & Co. at the moment, aren't don't they? Don't say that, Maya. Do not, do, don't, we're not taking a loan from these people. I think we should take a loan of $10. I mean, there's that $500 you owe me from our card game, for starters. We were not betting with real money, Maya. We agreed oh, at the start to use Monopoly money. money on, we agreed at the start games. to use Monopoly money, and then you tried to pull this shit later on, like, Listen, oh, buddy. trying to gaslight me. All I'm saying is next game, you're going to be, like, really into card games, and you're going to owe me all that mm. shit back. What are you right? talking about? I'm just letting you know that. Next I'm time just, we play, like, you're getting, a, you're getting that money. It's a simple fact. It's a simple nah. fact that's been decided. You I spoke to the Oracle with Delphi, and that's what she said would happen. Why don't you take out a loan, huh? Of $500? Because then I would die. Because then I would die. I think you should do it. I think you should shut the fuck up. I think you should kill yourself right now. I think you should fucking jump jump through that window between the gap between the, the T and the E. Squeeze through it like Flat Stanley. See if you can. <laughs> I might. Might be able so, to. I'm kind, of, I'm kind of small. Let's so say why did you my skip my line? line? Like that, I'm, I thought you read it. I'm sorry. You so, no, you were talking I, I over you were me done. the entire time. I, assumed, I had no okay. chance. In my defense, the line was E, U, A, all right? I assumed you would have just, like, <laughs> if you hadn't already finished it, you would have been fine if I'd skipped no, it. No, we... she was saying stuff. The laughing was at the end. Real, real, I can't. <laughs> real quick, I, uh, I wanted to see how far we were into the investigation. Check the train. Um... I, I, I was very, I was really curious. I wanted to see how far we were into the into the investigation, and um, we've completely somehow been able to skip a location. I think we definitely have to go there eventually. What? But <laughs> normally, skip the location. normally, Ace Attorney investigations are very like, Wait, like they won't they won't let you continue on to like the next area until you complete the first area. Uh. But we didn't present something, <laughs> so we didn't <laughs> unlock an area. And we've just blown over it. That's funny. This is oh, awesome. This We're never leaving this location. I'm not allowed to stop listening to Peaches. <laughs> Hold on. I have to find the uh, transcript. Uh, there is none. Nice to be or turnabout transcript. No. I'll pull it up. I already have it. Wait, what line are the, is this? So, um. We're, it's so, the one right before um, this one. Damn it. I think I'm on the wrong one. I think we're on part two of this track? I think we're on part three. Part three of the investigation. All right, so, um... Oh, yeah, you're right. Damn it, uh, it looks like we're not. Damn, what? Oh, it doesn't include the investigations in the transcript. This is just the, uh, the What? Trials. Damn. Funny. Wait, no, No, that's does. not possible. It does. Uh, I'll, I'll just... Repayment. Hold oh. on, what's this place called? Tender Lender? Yeah. It was Tender Lender Ellipses something 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 he he he. Alright, well you guys do that. I'm gonna go look at uh, Art on Twitter. Oh, okay. good idea. Okay, fella. Alright, I'm expanding everything. Oh, okay. Tender Lender is on your side. That's what it was. Okay. Tender Lender is on your side. <laughs> All right, it's done. Anyway, uh, that was worth it. No. And you skipped your own line. <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> like, fuck. I have to reopen the transcript so I can. No, I already have the transcript. Hold on, I gotta just, I just so, um, gotta let's say line. I'm late with my repayment. What happens then? Oh, I know. I did read that. You yes, did? you did. Yeah, I did. No. Then I just am a dumb. Um, righto, dido. I think I'd rather skip town.
Hey, just remember I can make strong coffee too, Nick. Strong tea as well. Tea so oh, strong it'll kick your ass. Yeah, I bet. So, um, do you know about the incident we're investigating? What incident? Jesus Christ. Well, a man was poisoned in a restaurant just near here. That incident. Let me see. I was here that day with the manager. The manager being the Tiger? Whoa, whoa there. Shut up. Shut, up. <laughs> Shut your stupid mouth. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know your name, but it seems you should be shopping for new friends. Uh, shut the fuck up. Could you maybe pick this up a little bit? I'm going to be late for my appointment with the Grim Reaper in about 45 years. Furio Tigre. Furio? Tigre? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> Zinniop's got a real name, Nick. Hurry up and find more about him. Why oh. is his name my first name but backwards? Shouldn't it be my last name but backwards, then my first name but backwards? Shouldn't his name right be... Right backwards like, is not like pronounceable right tigger t-h-g-i-r-w it's tigger it's tigger tigger genia oh so like so like tigger t-i-g-r-e we Hold just on. add like Let's... a furio before that and we got a golden name right t-h-g-i-r-w if i was gonna pronounce that it'd be tigger okay <laughs> if i had to pronounce it yes. i would have gone with thug ryu who cares Anyway, uh, thanks for this. I'm gonna investigate the rest of this office now. Little desk! Touch the desk, touch the desk, touch the desk, touch the desk. Impressive rug. It's solid gold, Nick. Gold. Just look at that shine. Only real gold shines like that. Would you really want such a shiny desk, though? No. I don't know, but let's see what it's like to sit at a solid gold desk. Let me spin on the chair and, and, I feel like and, it would and up like a gift. Teeth. Wow, I'm completely dazzled. That's I because it's completely dazzling. <laughs> oh, shit. I can see... What the hell does that say? What? It says I can see up my nose. I can see up my nose in the reflection. That's got to be really distracting. So the desk isn't practical. No surprise there. What about Jesus, Wait, Louisa? Did somebody join me? No, I don't think so. I thought somebody joined me. I, I would hate to be the poor son of a bitch who accidentally <laughs> joins that. Uh, it's really not that bad. Why does the desk look brown in this? Wait, that's a different desk. She spun around on a different desk? It that's looks crazy. like it, yeah. Speaking crazy. Of like that's cuckoo for coconuts. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Get a winter compromise. Uh, that was, that was, that was, all right. I wonder what that's supposed to mean. It must mean something if they took the trouble to frame it like that. Yeah, well, it still doesn't make any sense to me. That. Ah! Why do I keep screaming? That's the Guiding Principle. Oh? And as <laughs> for the screaming, it's because I know how to do that. I have that effect on people of your persuasion. Comprise the customer to win. What was that? I have not heard a single word this woman has said because the kid's pop is too loud. <laughs> <laughs> How's it feel to have a less impressive voice than kid's pop? <laughs> 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 
That's a great voice. I Fuck just it. can't hear I'm it. I'm skipping it. Fuck it. <laughs> no, she said it. That's the thing. Oh, oh I, I didn't hear her say it. I, I, all I heard was ad libs. Yeah, uh, well, as long as we don't have to compromise my hair, I'd say we're okay. One slogan no business owner should ever explain to their customers. Uh, maybe the Daruma? You know, actually, I have a weird feeling that none of this is relevant. I should just present something funny. Fuck it, dude. Hey, about this. Never mind. Hey, about this. Never mind. Uh, hey, about this. Never mind. There's a full three seconds of delay for the visuals. I'm gonna see if I can fix that. Hey, about this. Never mind. Hey, about this. Never mind. Hey, about this. Yeah, I didn't think so. Remember your Say, what do you think about this? Remember yeah, your okay. profiles. Why would I present? All right. Hey, about this. Oh. You dick. <laughs> Wait. Sure. sure. Okay, none of this is relevant. Uh huh. What? what? <laughs> no, this is relevant. <laughs> yeah, Seven this is relevant. Seven cups of coffee. It's okay. I haven't missed anything anyway. Whatever your name is. And I owe Don Tigre my life. He's the one who saved me. I yeah, alright, I buy that. All seven cups. And please address him properly as Don Tigre. Otherwise, I'll have to. Alright, yeah, okay. Don Tigre, of course, I'm sorry. He saved her life? What the fuck is she talking about? Eight. No. So, never mind. Oh, Jean Armstrong? Yeah, yeah. Never mind. You don't know shit. Okay, what about Glenn? All right, you don't know fucking nothing about nothing about nobody. What about Victor? That's that makes sense. What about Dick Gumshoe? That's cool. Nobody knows anything about him. He's a kind of an enigma. What about Maggie Bird? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, didn't think so. He's really going through Go every piece of evidence. Ooh, not not, not much uh, not much knowledge in the mythology, huh? What about what my my old dead lawyer friend? All right, what about my <laughs> new dead lawyer friend? What? No? Okay. Uh, wait, what? Uh, it's a little just a little just a little bit of light foreshadowing. Don't worry about it. Um, uh, you got nothing about that. All right, what the coffee cup? You know, nothing. That's cool. What about this crime photo? What about this hey, other just crime Just because I go photo? through character assassination does not mean I'm dead. Alright. This really- this bitch knows nothing, dude. She doesn't know a fucking thing about nothing, dude. Yeah, maybe you should talk to her. <laughs> no. Nah. I feel like if she doesn't know anything about anything else, I'm just gonna leave. Oh my, please don't. Go look for that other- that other thing that we missed. Yeah, 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 that's what it's called. <laughs> wow, she knows nothing. Alright, so what do I have to go to the precinct or January 7th, Vitamin Square? Oh, oh my god. Uh, there he is! Old CD's back feeding the pigeons again. Banished from my life! Oh, that oh, that take this! Fuck! <laughs> Like, I thought he's really mad. Come on, Maya, just keep your head down and let's sneak away while we can. What? Why? Hello, old man. Oh, Maya, what are you doing to me? Who's my favorite scrunkly bunkly? Huh? What the ah! <laughs> hey, he just turned his back on us. I'm not surprised. I bet it really hurt his pride. Hey, Mr. Kudo. Hmm. Ah, hmm, hmm. Hmm. Oh, vision. I'm mm. free. Look. We really need to talk to you, okay? Out with the demons! In with good fortune! <laughs> ow, ow, ow. Nah, Jeez, finally something I can agree with. Painful. I always knew you were a demon, Maya. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright, does he have anything? Fuck. Hey, I'm, I'm sorry about what spot. happened in court earlier today. Ah, everyone will be talking about me behind my back now. A dirty old man who was so busy looking at the serving girl's backside that he can't remember her face. A filthy, depraved animal. Hey, hold on. I'm, I, I, no. I, I, hold on. Pause real quick. Oh no. Oh, 98% encoded. That's crazy. Agreed. And it's 99%, dude. Got a minute and 12 seconds say. left. A minute, five seconds. I don't think the world is ready for 100% encoded. I don't think so. 
But I also didn't think they were ready for Peaches by Kids Bop. Here we are. I, I'm trying to see how many times I listened to it, but my uh, last FM didn't update since yesterday. So. The hell is last FM? Oh, it's just not going to update, I guess. That's fun. Alright, time to listen to Sophia the First a bunch of times in a row. Since I haven't done that in a couple of days. I, what is what is this? What oh, am I looking there at? There we go. What is last time? Uh, Twelve times. That's a decent. What is a scrabble? Times. So it's how many times you've listened to the songs for more than thirty seconds? What the hell? Yeah, you can tell that I'm cool because I've scrabbled uh, Sophia the first theme song a total of um, three hundred and nine times. That's impressive. Yeah, I've I've tried to do it once a day every day of the year. And I failed in February, so I've just been listening to it for like dozens of times at a time. Dude, why? Yeah, yeah. No, why is cloth I taken? Three sixty-five this year. I'm at two hundred ninety-three so far. How many days? In I'm back. Are we... Oh, uh, you know, two twelve in the park. Wow, I'm I'm actually doing great. Do you like parks, Nathan? Uh. Yeah. I what guess. about recreation? Um, <laughs> I don't have anything against recreation. recreation. Nathan, what is your favorite? Uh, 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 um, what do they call them? What uh, I don't remember. What what's your favorite thing in a playground? Uh, damn, what's it called? The spinny thing. You know what I'm talking about, right? The spinny thing. The the, like, mirror, like, no, not the mirror. What are they called? Carousel thing? Like, that you stand on There's and There's, like, like, 11 dirt. spinny things. Can you describe it in more detail? Talk about the thing with the rails on it, that, like, you stand on and it spins around, right? Or are you talking about the chairs? The roundabout. Okay, uh, that's a thing on a road. Let me see what you're talking about. Roundabout. Play Round. Round. Oh, that's not what I was thinking. Okay, about yeah, I was. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. Where you stand on it, you spin around. Or okay. as I Those used to do cool. at the playground at my old church, well, me and a group of friends would take turns, one of us standing, and oh, the shit, rest of us shit, spinning it as fast as we could, literally <laughs> running around in a circle until we got too dizzy to hold on and we would let go. That's pretty funny. I think my favorite is probably the swings. I think the worst one is probably the slide, because a good slide what? is good, but a bad slide is good dog shit. You you get a bad slide, and it is just horrible. Like, a bad no, version of any dude. other playground thing is still, like, good, but a bad slide is really bad. Nah, disagree. The worst thing at a playground is the fucking, the pole, like, the weird, like like uh twisty poles that you're supposed to slide down all right we're back those I are need bad. More. I, I need a visual aid i don't know all right hold on uh playground pole uh okay well this isn't exactly the one i was looking for but like yeah things they kind of kind of like this but like they're like twisty Oh, like just the fire pole? Like, yeah. Uh, I don't. They're just don't... so fucking small and like. Yeah, I so, guess. Like, it's just, that is like such a rare fixture of playground. No, that's at every playground, dude. There's a fire no, pole. No, I've, play, I, I, I've been to a couple different playgrounds and a fire pole? style thing is pretty common but a twisty one that's very rare i've only seen like one okay but possibly but i'm like every playground i've ever been to michael what's your favorite fixture to playground swings good man good man normy ass bitch i'm sorry are awesome I'm trying to and there's nothing no, no, no. wrong with being no, no, no. a swing fan i'm not i'm not saying i'm not saying it's a bad choice it's 
It's like pumpkin spice. It's good, and most people will agree, but that still makes you a normie. There's nothing wrong with being a normie. Anyways. Uh, incorrect. Unless you like pumpkin but spice. But also correct. What'd you say, Andrew? Nothing wrong with being a normie unless you like pumpkin spice. Why specifically pumpkin spice? Because it's what Nathan said. What the fuck? He said something about pumpkin spice, so I'm just like... He did, he did. Yeah. And fuck Uh pumpkin spice in particular. I I don't know. I feel like pumpkin spice is less egregious than Uggs. Uggs are pretty egregious. Guys, I've only got an hour. Let's continue. Please. We've been... We haven't done anything in the last hour. What are you talking about? Yes, we have. We talked to LT Gray and, um... Yeah, I don't know what Uggs right, are. These look to be shoes. They're are you listening yeah. to me, boy? They're I don't care nice what you say. I saw that waitress put it in. These are Uggs. I have no issue with Uggs. She put some white powder into the young lad's javachino. Crack. Yes. We hear you. I, I feel like I see people wear. I, I see more people wearing Doc Martens than Uggs. Well, another thing. The young lady who was wearing an earpiece. I guess hugs are more. Well, on the same side as the lens of his broken spectacles. We're really sorry. So I made a little mistake about the vase. So what? I know what I saw. I tell you, I tell you, I tell you. Okay, okay, okay. Take it easy, please. Don't tell me to take it easy, you spiky-haired brat! Take this! You bastard. Uh, you said you were a craftsman, right? Ah, the modern world casts on us craftsmen like me aside in droves. Surely it's not that. I come from a long line of craftsmen, right back to the time of the Shoguns. Do you hear me? I didn't become an embroiderer. I was born one! Actually, I'm kind of the same situation myself. I... I... I wanted to stick my fingers up that dribbling old judge's nose. And scream right down his ear hole, OBJECTION! Oh, so did you want to become a lawyer when you were young? Or is it just like a recent thing? I don't think that's quite it, Maya. I think he's just in a bad mood. I've got a tsunami of frustration inside and it's ready to burst out! If we let him start rambling now, we might never shut him up. I'm gonna... Uh, 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 cut in. Um, actually, we've got places to go, things to check, and... Uh, stuff. Maybe another time? Fine, whatever. Just don't forget, I've got a tsunami's worth of grumbling to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, see you. I didn't- I'm so sorry. I never said anything. That's a good point. Come to the place where I work, then. Yeah, bring this along with you. This is... I'm not- I'm not keeping this. I'm throwing this away immediately. He really wants someone to grumble at, huh? Although it is a burger joint, so I can't pass that up. Although I don't have any money to buy burgers, so, uh... Hmm. Uh, you said you were a craftsman, right? Ah, the mo- oh. Was I supposed to let him keep talking? Yes. This is the worst. Guess I better let him talk. So there's not much call for craftsmen these days, eh? No, of course not, you idiot! All I'm good for nowadays is running errands! Errands? Everyone takes advantage of the elderly. Buy some bread, Gramps. Take the dog for a walk, Grandad. Feed the pigeons, old man. What am I, some sort of two-bit community handyman? Who's telling you to uh, feed the pigeons? Well, that's what I want to know. Buy some bread. Now that I now that I can understand. But what's the point of feeding some seedy pigeons? Why don't people say what they mean? Get lost. That's what they're trying to say. Oh yes, I'm just an inconvenience, you see. 
At home, at that restaurant. I just get in the way, don't I? I'm sure that's not true. Wait a minute, what did he just say? At home and at that restaurant? Hold up. By restaurant, are you talking about Trebian? Did you get asked to run an errand there too? Yes, I did. The very day that young brat was poisoned. What? So on the day of the incident, what were you asked to do? Glad you asked, boy, because I'll tell you what I was asked to do. All of a sudden, that young lad slumped over the table. The serving girl collapsed. And I broke that vase. It all happened so fast, I was in a bit of a daze, you see. And the owner shouted over to me. This detective- You more. You call the police. Call them yourself! I should have said back. But I didn't think of it at the time. Oh. So did you end up calling the police? Like I said, I was in yes. a bit of a daze. This is the guy who called them, isn't it? God, do I look like I'd have one of those newfangled cell phones? I went out looking for a payphone, of course. It is, yeah, that's what you said. One? None of this is new information. I couldn't find one right away, you know. Wandered around for five minutes or so. Yeah, that's about five right. Five minutes? So for five minutes after the incident happened. Yes, sirree. The owner was at Trespian on his own. Oh, shit. So why didn't you mention this in court? Well, I would have if you'd given me the chance. You son of a bitch. But you all bullied me out of the courtroom. <sighs> Flashback. A flashback! Oh, embarrassed flashback. Angry flashback. No, not the angry flashback! Oh, flashback. I just had a- I just had a flashback, and the judge was angry in the flashback. Anyways, it's not my fault! You're the ones to blame! Oh, you could have at least told us before we got to court. Is it really that important that Mr. Kudo was the one who called the police? I thought we knew that. What's important is the unaccounted time before the police arrived. The victim was dead, and Maggie was unconscious. Which leaves that woman, I mean that man, I mean that Gene Armstrong, alone in the restaurant. Mr. Kudo might have been chased out of the place on purpose. What do you mean? Maybe a certain someone didn't want him in the restaurant. Ah. Oh sure, you go ahead and say I was in the way as usual. I suppose I should have been getting myself covered in pigeon poop instead, hmm? What? <laughs> what are you talking about, dude? Alright, whatever. Uh, listen, I gotta run some errands. I guess maybe I, I should go back to Tenderlander now. Hey, what's up? How's it going? Are you gonna finally answer me about what your name is? No. <laughs> Me? I'm God! No, the cute I'm very Me? Mailing. My name is Mickey Mouse! And what? I'm the judge. Wait, 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 wait hold on, Judge, Come what are you goofy. doing here? Judge, I thought I thought you didn't have Just legs. Check it in. I'm my favorite loan office. <laughs> <laughs> very good to see you again. And I am the count. <laughs> no. <laughs> anyway, just recently I died once again. Oh man, that's nothing. I died twice. You. D oh, that's true. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot that times. that little bit of god lore right there. You d died. I thought God has only had About one canon death. Four months ago. Yeah, but then Jesus got another one and Jesus is God. No, but that was that no. Jesus was his singular canon death, I thought. When was his other one? Does anyone care about Cerberus? <laughs> uh well they killed him, put him in the from tomb. Hades? Killed him in no from Helltaker. 
Looks like he did. Uh, does anyone care about Nahida? No, it's not a real person. Okay, it's a rolls it's a Genshin child character. No one cares. You're oh, right. Nathan Good point. But she's servers. worth a little bit. Oh, oh hey, Nagatoro. Nagatoro. <laughs> That's crazy Dude. how how I'm not going to claim her. I was sitting there. Instantaneous take. Just I was money. Oh. I was literally sitting there debating. I wouldn't have claimed her if I'd have if I'd even watched the show. Damn. It's not even. Hey Michael, you should roll women oh, instead. Michael, you should not roll women. Okay. You should roll women. Thank you. you. Specifically, not roll women. I'm not gonna. I've I've already lost my chance to get the. Ha! Huh, I didn't lose my chance to get money. Oh no, no, my idea. McGonagall. Minerva McGonagall. Wow, oh, fucking shit rolls. Yeah, pretty bad. You can take money. Money was offered earlier. Or you can take Oriko food. Okay. Do I away. even have a claim? Uh, or you can take. No, I did that for no you reason. Ate my rolls, bro. You can take Maho Manami. Or Mao Manami. <laughs> Mao Manami. I'm good. Or Coco. What about Carol Emerald? Oh, Maria. Oh, from El Tigre. What timing? What timing? What good timing? Uh, Nothing character from anime that's on my list. Nothing. Cool. Trash. All right. All right. Dude, Polywag. Oh, I almost moment. forgot about peeing. <laughs> oh, dude, Squovet and Flaffy. It's pronounced Squovet. Sh shut the fuck up. <laughs> no. <laughs> Squovet. Is a very male coded Pokemon. It is. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, moving on. Um, yo, what happened about four months ago? Fucking nothing. Oh. Not a single goddamn thing. Not the even one. The doctor said to abandon all hope. I guess they were expecting her to take a boat ride across the river Styx. It's kind of fucking rude, me. Yeah. <laughs> but Don Tigre. He saved me. He gave up everything. Everything? Both kidneys, an ample amount of bone marrow, but then money I too. When I found out what he had done for me, I was happy. No offense, but I'm finding that hard to believe. Just a wee bit. I <laughs> decided I'd pay him back my life by serving him coffee and espresso. That's logical. I still e wonder about what's in her coffee. Everyone in this it's... damn game loves their coffee so much. Like, it's ridiculous. It's... So is, uh, is that why you've got that bandage around your head? Four months ago, huh? <laughs> oh my god. So what's the story with the bandage? They put it on after the operation. Operation? The hit game by Hasbro Entertainment? The very same. It's just a little injury. A little fatal terminal injury. A fatal injury? Maya just suffered one herself by the sound of it. So that's so the injury you were talking about before when you said you had died once. Psycho Loco? A lot of Psycho Loco, Jesus Christ. It's a couple. It's one that's or two. the second most I've more. ever seen in the series. Ugh. She really creeps me out, Nick. Although her song kind of bangs. Same here. But we've got to find out the truth. Ick. Ick. <laughs> you are not ready for Megatama. Watch this, though. You didn't say it. How about this? Oh, no. Well, okay, Can now I actually can't. My it, that's okay. I, I just simply can't. One has to tell me her name. Do I didn't you? say it. I didn't say it, therefore I can't. I guess I'll leave. Yes. Out of shame. Okay. Um. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Hey! Lots of stuff happening, I hope. Nope. Oh, you know. Charlie time, baby. January 7th, police station, criminal affairs department. Is Gumshoe here? Fuck! Looks like Gumshoe's not here. I wonder where he could be, right? Oh, never mind that. What's going on? It feels different here somehow. 
I don't know, there, there's a, like a pink thing. Yeah, everyone seems to be on edge. What you, are you doing? Call in the officers for the briefing a quick. Is that Detective Mario? No, oh, bro, can't you shut down the station server? Is that Detective My Cousin? Oh. <laughs> Eve, quit playing on the internet, mamma mia! About my email, Ben Pal, 1337 is the, oh, the Asian, Asian, Asian uh, princess. No. That's horrible. That's, that's pretty bad. I don't that's want that horrible. Leave it for later. I'm turning it off. No. No. My Ben Bell. No. <laughs> Everyone's keeping busy in here, huh? <laughs> that's funny. Um, everyone's keeping busy in here, huh? <laughs> We're swapping lines, by the way. That's the joke. Oh, keeping busy? More like panicking, if you ask me. Something big's going on. Something big. All right, thank you. Um, well, bye-bye. <laughs> I don't know why. Viola's voice is surprisingly hard on my on my vocal cords, and I don't know why. That's a shame. That it's is really weird. Good. Oh, wait. Before, no, 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 no. Please, please, please. No, 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 please. Go back. No. Cool. January 7th, trust me in, kitchen. Looks like Mr. Armstrong's out again. Damn it. Okay, but okay. the place is open for business. You can't have an open restaurant without a chef. Hey, it's not my fault, Nick. Don't take it out on me. Nope. <laughs> Only a couple of minutes after the incident happened. Mr. Kudo left the scene, leaving Mr. Armstrong here alone. Ah, uh, missing when we need to talk to him the most. Maybe he's trying to avoid us on purpose? That sounds right. Maybe, mm. just because I'm out let's of steal. practice. Let's <laughs> steal everything. Although I think it's, it's kind of funny. <laughs> it's, like, it's gonna be the wow, same look at all these blue bottles. Oh, wow, look at all of them. So, wow, oh, there's so many bottles. bottles. Alright. Wow. Okay, Nothing here. can you present the victim to Gumshoe? I pushed the wrong button. Oh, you bitch! That's Glad to see it's not made of cardboard anymore. This guy was a real programming genius. Worked with the greats, like Chihiro Fujisaki. They called him the walking computer at the place where, yeah, sure, just skip the rest of it. What happens when he crashes, though? Does he just I, stop I thought all you of a sudden? just remembered the line. I did. Yeah, there was uh, two uh, words left. <laughs> there was. There was. And I uh, didn't see them, because I'm stupid. I see. It wasn't literally a computer, Maya. Haha, <laughs> laugh track. <laughs> laugh track. <laughs> That's not what laugh track sounds like. There's nothing between Maggie and the victim. Yeah, that's what we found out yesterday, too. Hey, Detective Gumshoe, don't you have any information that's a bit more fun? Uh, fun? Oh, I know. So, have you paid a visit to Ms. where Mr. Elg worked at? Yeah, you might as well. His workplace? Where's that? A computer firm called Blue Screens Inc. or something like that. Sounds like a real stable company. This could be fun, Nick. Let's go. Computers aren't really my thing, Maya. We'll be fine. I know all about that high-tech stuff. I wonder about that. It's just around the corner from this joint. You should take a look. A computer firm I called Blue Screens, screens Inc., huh? Somebody was listening to the SpongeBob soundtrack? Who was it? Uh, um... <laughs> I saw for a singular frame somebody was listening to the SpongeBob soundtrack. Which one of you I'm not did it? Listening to How anything? long ago was this? Like a minute ago, I during this conversation, it had to have been Nathan. I've been listening it, it to Deborah for two minutes been. straight. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, I can't believe you ruined me che checking the lyrics for fun. Oh, and fun. ruined my. Was. I was about to sing it as Gumshoe. But... <laughs> I I see. Oh God. But now it's ruined. The 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 surprise has been destroyed. 
I thought that I had everybody on bro. my side, but I went and blew it all sky high. We got a big meeting starting in a bit. About Maggie's Casey meme. No, that's pretty much wrapped up now. There's another big case going down at the moment, so she's been pushed aside. Oh, schnitzel. Oh, okay. Well, see you later then. Bye. Bye. Adios. There he goes. Bye. Evans, prefer to do stuff together. And he's back. Did you forget your wallet? You whistle for you and me. You better get going, detective. You'll be late. And it's for anyone, and anytime at all. Actually, I am, uh... And it's for no survivors. When you... <laughs> I've kind of got a favor to ask. It's a big one. Down here in the deep blue sea. A favor? Yeah. It's for a Maggie, actually. I was kind of hoping you'd uh, give this to her for me. Oh my god. Gumshoe, is that microwave hot dogs and rice? Yes, yes, I'll give this to her. That's so sweet of you. What is it? Microwave hot dogs and rice. Holy crap! I got up early so I can eat. I know a lot. This is a huge lunchbox. I'm really worried about this. She looks like she'd lost a lot of weight. There's like three weeks worth of rice in here. That's not true in the slightest. Detective Gumshoe. Are you implying that each of those wingies is like an actual hot dog size? It's a full hot dog, yes. That is not true. How many it's wingies true. are in here? There's not a single person on earth who could down this much meat. That's a clue. Okay, sense. my the text agrees with me. There's a lot of food. You think I love wienies? I can't get enough of the tender juiciness. Oh, what the fuck is going sense. on? <laughs> so, will you give it to her? Took me ages to make, so please say you will, pal. Uh, Gumshoe, I promise I will give Maggie your weenie. <laughs> yes. Well, weenie. when you say it like that, don't make things weird, Phoenix. I'm not making it weird. This is just so what's happening. I'm just saying what's love happening. And plenty of weenies. I love this. Maybe I'll eat it myself <laughs> if I get hungry. That's really what it says. Oh, nice. <laughs> Maya, you are not. I forbid you from eating gumshoes wings. Oh man! Don't forget, okay? I'm counting on you to give that to Maggie. She will get the weenie. The the one? Just the weenie. Where's the rest sorry. of them going? I'm sorry, I misspoke. Okay, look, Phoenix, you're only permitted to continue making that jo joke as long as it's not anywhere within her vicinity. January seventh, blue screen ink. Uh, no promises. I don't know who voices this one. Uh, me. I already checked. Awesome. Wow, this place is so oh high tech. Ah, I did it again! Like Sorry. <laughs> what? Stop. Maya, he could... fucking unplugged his headphones again. <laughs> yeah, Maya, could, you, could you repeat that line so the, the audience doesn't hear it uh, doubled? Yes, mm -hmm. okay, here we go. Wow, this place is so high tech. You can almost smell the electricity in the air. It is that? a computer firm, Maya. <laughs> That's awesome. Who are you? Oh, um, hello. I'm sorry. Access is restricted to authorized personnel only. Oh, fuck. Nick, I, I think this is the human personification of the Walmart self-checkout machine. <laughs> <laughs> I I didn't I don't know how I didn't notice it till now. She looks but like if an airport runway was a person. Hundred percent of the new characters. In this yeah, place. I didn't notice it either until I was looking at. It, I'm like, well, here we go. <laughs> Dude, she's gonna start fucking <laughs> casting Oscar R spells at us any minute now. This is a computer programming laboratory. There are far too many trade secrets that could be leaked. This woman blames the beast every night before bed. Wow, let's see this. <laughs> Heaven or hell. Everything you Fine. see here is classified. No information can leave this building. Understood. Who is this woman? She's like a robot from some kind of whack educational show. She looks like a villain from Where in Time is Car Carmen San Diego. My name That's is your name? Lisa Basil. 
You do not deserve the name Basil. It's, you see, like all characters in this world, it is a pun. In this That's case, mine is a... Uh... It's the same forward and backwards. I the palindrome. There we go. Finally figured it out mid-sentence. You stole my thunder. I'm sorry. I'm actually not. <laughs> Just had to make that clear. I'm the company director. I'm the company director, actually. Sorry, but you're, uh, you've been replaced. Check this out. Uh, here's my here's my uh, application that I did. Uh, one second. I, I, I actually need one, more than one throat clear. Uh, give me a second. I think I can beat you to your own joke. Okay. Please one place second. item in bagging area. <laughs> That's actually not what I was going for. I was going to go with insert cash or select payment type. That one was good, too. <laughs> Little purple child. Yes? When is the porcupine going to speak again? I don't know. Uh, I, you know, <laughs> he's kind of just standing here, <laughs> staring at the computer screens. He is. I, is he I a, don't know. Is he a tech fan? No, he doesn't believe in technology, actually. I don't, I don't think he knows what a cellular phone is. Then what are you doing here? Oh, we're here, we're here to talk with somebody uh, named Glenn Elg. Oh, the dead one! Yeah, that's the one. You got it. You can't talk to him. He's dead. We'll find a way. I'll, I, I'm a spirit medium, after all. I can, I can channel him or something. I mean, we might be able to put his spirit into a machine. No, this is just... Ghost this is way show? too early for you to have an AI replica of him yet. So, uh... Oh, too early? I don't think. Too early? Too early, yeah. How could it be too early? It's the fabulous year of 2019? Yeah, AI didn't become good until, um, 2024. Didn't you know that? Uh, you forget we live in San Francisco. You see, my oh, clothes shit. have LEDs in them. Most people would consider this a fire hazard, but I consider it aesthetic. You know, that makes a lot of sense. Uh, I, I feel the same way about my outlets in my house. <laughs> Ex explain. <laughs> yeah, so so people are like, okay, don't plug too many things into the same outlet. Uh, but here's what I do. Uh, I, I learned it, a, a neat little trick. It's called you take a power strip, you plug it into the wall, take another power strip, plug it into the power strip, take another power strip, plug it into that power strip, and you just keep going out until you have like oh. so many outlets. <laughs> you can plug as much as you want in there. I understand. I have... Do you see all those wires on the floor? Yes. They all connect like to the same. To no, they all connect to the same outlet. That's what I was going to say. Oh my god! We can bond over this! Yeah! This might be my favorite one ever! <laughs> this space we rented was too small. Only had one plug. Oh, that makes sense. Was it you... at least a grounded outlet? No! Oh, fuck. That's, that's not good. That's really not good. It's okay, we'll be fine. Well, uh... <laughs> well, damn, you're gonna have to stick a three-prong into a two-prong somehow. How did you manage that? We um, have our ways. Oh. I don't know if it's just because my brain is melting or uh, what, but for some reason, uh, when I saw Viola and Basil, I was immediately like, they seem very sapphic. <laughs> I don't no. know if that's just me. Yeah, that's pretty much just you. Yeah, Honestly, my. When you said their names together, I was like, damn, they kind of look like the same character from different camera angles. My no favorite, my favorite, my my favorite Ace Attorney lesbian shit, the AI woman and no, no, the no, murder not woman together, not shipping them, just like they, not together. Oh, then yeah, I definitely don't see any. Yeah, and my boot is broke just because I'm tired. Yeah, you're you're you need to get some rest. I do. I mean, I can't blame you. Like, 80% of the Ace Attorney cast is gay. I don't know. I, I just get such, like, average white woman energy from Lisa Basil that I, I kind of can't see it. Viola, though. Nah, Viola, I can kind of nah, see. Nah, Lisa, Lisa Basil is an asexual woman. 
All she cares about is her computer. But she is she into her computer sexually? Yes. Oh yeah, that makes more sense. Like asexual in the human sense, you know? Yeah, that that completely checks out. No, no, no. She's asexual, but she's computer romantic. <laughs> oh yeah, she doesn't want to do anything freaky with her computer. She just wants to have a long last. No, no, because if she does, if she if she does something freaky with her computer, she's gonna, you know, like, she's gonna mess it up. Like, she does, she, just, she does something freaky with her computer. She's gonna mess it up, and she, she doesn't want to do that because she cares too much about her computers. Yeah. What? I don't understand. Computers? Computers, I'm the company director. Hi, welcome back, Porcupine. This is the company <laughs> director. The she plugs plane. her toys directly into her computer. What? What the fuck? What the actual shit? What is happening? They made a sequel to God and he's horny? What, what? the fuck? <laughs> they made a sequel to God and he's horny. That's a sentence. Yeah, I thought so. Alrighty. It does have a subject and a verb. <laughs> okay, Miss Clip on Tie, what were you talking about? Uh huh, yep. S yep, Scouter. That line was painfully funny. That's the a don't hug me, I'm said scared, that right? Andrew, I drank some water. It took all my brain power to not nice immediately try. projectile vomit all the water in my mouth. Oh god. <laughs> it's the other way around, Maya. It's an HMD. <laughs> All of my programmers here at Blue Screens Inc. are supplied with HMDs. Oh Even cool, everyone we'll at the Wright & Co. Law Offices are, uh, given, uh... Oh damn, I can come up with a funny acronym in time. <laughs> Anyways, Alcas. we just really like wearing these. It also tells us your power level. They are pretty cool, I wouldn't mind one. What's my I, power level? You know level? what, I need one on Pearl, I need to know her power level right now. Well, unfortunately, she isn't in front of me, so I can't tell you the power level of this Pearl person. What I can tell you, though, is at least one of you has a 200, and the other has a 5. Damn, Nick. Is I that on, uh, better from you. Is that on standard mode, or is that on legal? Can you change <laughs> that to legal real quick? Uh, my legal power level. Well, let's see. About... I'm on the edge of my seat. I'm waiting. Nick, I think you blue screened her. <laughs> wow. All right. Um, um, this is catastrophic to the case. <laughs> um, I don't think you're going to be able to win questions. this one. This sucks. I guess we have so... no choice but to... Uh, give up. Loading. What the... Uh... So, so what do you, what do you, what do you do Family here? Alright, sorry. According to your bar exam score. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's at least passing. I didn't take the bar, Nick, so this is uh, your legal... immediately disadvantaging me. Your legal power level comes out to... 1,420. Ooh. Maya! That's a number! Yours comes out to... 690. What? Wow, that's pretty good. Uh, how many points With do you get that for kind of legal prowess, I could probably get myself out of the pickle of getting arrested next time I do it. I don't- I don't think that's true. You won't. Anyways, I, I will try- myself. I will try to simplify it so that you can understand. That's rude. We analyze the data management systems required by certain branches of industry. Oh wow, that- okay, that was- yeah, that was pretty understandable, thanks for that. And then deliver optimum operating systems and source level components to them. Neat. Yep, I understood all of that. Although I don't really know what analyze or management mean. <laughs> it doesn't matter, they analyze stuff, you got that your legal right. Your legal power no, I, has I dropped to 300. I just told oh. you I don't know what analyze means, Nick. How did you? Uh, how would you? How would that have helped? Your legal power is Dude. rapidly dropping. Oh fuck! Uh, if I get arrested, I'm 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 straight out of luck now. The software we produce is distributed on CDs. 
In 2019? <laughs> uh, that's, uh -huh. that's very funny. That's very funny. Compact discs, huh? Fuck you. You saw right <laughs> what I was going through. Yeah, why not Blu-rays? Anyways, yes, compact disc. Digital optical storage media. Uh, of course. The CDs are used for software as well as music. I read your mind. Brilliant. You said CD. AKA, CD's nuts. LMAO, got em. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, please, please. Why did they, okay. If the MC Bomber CD is software, why was it in a fucking boom box? That's what I want to know, all right? That's a disguise? Or maybe... Why, why wouldn't they just put it in a drawer? He's a dumbass and doesn't know that it's a program? I could see that happening. I like, I like how I was repeatedly saving. Well, yeah, gotta make sure. Gotta make double sure. It oh, is a small right. firm, but all my employees are first-class programmers. Let's ask one of them what they are doing. Holy shit, that guy's dead. Excuse me. Employee zero, 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 one. What are you working on right now? I'm, I'm researching the impact of logical axis, shared variables, influences, response time, plus memory overheads, finally important. All right, that's it. Never speak again. You get the idea. This is the sort of thing we are involved in. Did you good people follow all of that? Yep, I sure did. Your blank smile says otherwise, Maya. You know about what happened, right, Miss Basil? You mean about Glenn being poisoned? Yes, I know. It's terrible. He was employee zero. 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 Three. Oh, Can you high ranking. Anything else that might be helpful? I don't think so. A police officer was here earlier, too. But I couldn't tell him anything either because... The waitress who committed the crime has nothing to do with Blue Screens, Inc. Uh, fuck, what? Excuse me? What? Oh, Are okay. the details of my man's death proprietary information? It makes no sense. What? Okay. Have you cleared out Glenn's desk yet? Oh, I was just about to. It's this one oh. right in front of you. Oh. If there's anything that might be useful to you, you're welcome to take it. I was going to incinerate I... it anyways. I suppose there might the whole ass desk? Yes. Well, except the computer. That seems excessive. Um, wow, there's... Ooh, there's a... What are you there's kind of a lot going on up? here. Don't ask questions, purple girl. Purple girl. I asked you a very clear question, and you avoided it. It's a lot it. of fun. It's, it's a big talk from the fucking Pokemon Elite trainer. <laughs> Look at this mess. If only somewhere were here to clean it. Maybe employee like zero, 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 zero. What kind of betting tickets, huh? I think tickets, huh? she's probably zero, 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 zero. I know. That's, that's, what I'm, that's what I'm saying, Nick. Don't. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't steal your thunder. Uh, for betting on which horse will win a given race. Oh wow, his drawers are stuffed full of these. Yeah, he's a bit of a fucking addict. Um, not sure why he kept them all. This many tickets would get you what? A buck down at the recycling center? But I didn't know you were so... Uh, uh, uh um... <laughs> I didn't know you so, uh... I didn't, I didn't know, know you, you were, were so, so poor! You try to profit from the dead, Nick. Okay, Maya. I've never heard that phrase in my whole You've life. You've never that heard that? Means? I've never heard that. Just means that down phrase. on your luck. I've ne I've never heard that. In phrase. a bad spot, between a rock and a hard place. Hard okay. up. Okay. All right. I don't believe you, but only because I'm scared. Whoa! Look at this desk, Nick. What a mess. It's the same one. It's pretty one. average to me. But you can't get any work done on, you know, with everything all over the place like this. Yeah, maybe you can't. Real whiz kids can work under any condition, you know? Just trying to hint that I should tidy my desk more. I won't. Hey, this calendar. What about it? If this is another hint about tidying, you can forget it. Someone's marked December 3rd in red pen. December 3rd? 
That's the day he was murdered. Is there anything else? Yeah, uh, it says, meet with El Tigre. Wait, Tigre. no, it's definitely been a month since the trial. It's yeah, January 7th, it's January 7th right now. Yes. Well, schnitzel, alright then. Wait, she hadn't cleared out his desk in a month? Yep. Well, yeah, everyone's murder like conveniently stuff. not cleaning up anything crime related after a month. <laughs> yeah. Hey, look, Nick, it's a supercomputer. Like the ones they have at NASA. Um, it looks like it's oh. really smart and wise, doesn't it? You should ask it a question. Like, uh, why, why are hot dogs in packs of eight, but hot dog buns are in packs of 12? Computers are only as smart as the humans who use them, Maya. Uh... Oh, so they're probably fucking genius then, if I'm in charge of it. Anyways, that explains why we don't use the computer in our office. You work there too, Maya? Uh, no, I don't. Because I don't get paid. Please, don't True. argue about something that's so trivial. Sorry, I almost opened okay, it for sure. Otherwise, the computer will laugh at you. Oh, that what? would be funny if it did that. She said she'd laugh at us, Nick. She's a human, Maya, not a computer. Alright. What are these wingums? Is this place alive? Nah, they just look a bit twisted or warped or whatever what are I'm looking for. This office <laughs> was designed with a futuristic feel in mind. Yeah, no shit. Looks like the inside of Meep ship. Futuristic? <laughs> yes. Did you say futuristic? We tried to imagine what things might look like in the future when we designed it. It helps to soothe and calm the soul. Yeah, Nick, everything's chrome in the future. This isn't even chrome. On this second is baby thought, blue. I agree with you, Nick. This place is really unsettling, and I want to die. Yeah, um, I'm gonna leave, I think. Wait, hold on. What is... What is that weird... What is that arm for? Because his monitor's on a normal stand. Oh, that's a great question. I've opened big picture mode. Hell yeah. Alright, um, well I guess I'll just leave. Is it just, like a, is it just like a really dinky lamp that's not connected to the computer? I don't know, maybe. Wait, wait, well, talk- I don't know. Can is you- there I can present to her? Yeah. She has nothing to talk about. She's a big, No, because I'm- big, I'm almost- bitch. I'm almost positive she, she has one is, uh... Say, have you ever heard of LT Grey? Say, have you ever heard of El Tigre? Super admin restricted desktop access. Do you get it? it doesn't, all right. Do you get it? Is it an, uh... Sparta? What? What? This is madness! Do you get it now? Yeah, I get it. Yes, I get it. All right, awesome. Are they? Uh, no, Maya, that is Sparta. She won't tell us unless we say the right code word. A code word? Hmm. Sesame! That is a good try. If it's not Sesame, that must be your mother's maiden name. That's how it always is. <laughs> There's no point in having a password if it's always the same thing, Maya. I guess she just doesn't want to talk about this. Maybe we should focus on asking about Glen Elk. What do you say? I say, thank you, Maya. That is the first helpful thing I think I've ever said in an investigation. Um, oh, Mr. Elg. He was a top programmer. I would even say he was a Ow. genius. Oh. But he did suffer from one or two bugs in his personality. Get it? You That's are, a programmer you joke. You are the director of a technology firm. You don't need to act like, you don't need to do this character. All right, you, you're not advertising anything. Is this really this? Is this how you act in your day-to-day -day life? When your parents come like to celebrate your birthday or anything, do you look at them with love in your eyes, or do they look back with fear? Yeah. Your credit yeah. score is two hundred and thirty-eight. <laughs> Actually, that is remarkably low. Well. <laughs> it is. That's why. I feel like it wasn't that low <laughs> the last time I checked. 
All I've right. been preparing for that line my whole life and you just skipped it. Oh, question mark, what's that, question mark? It was like what? Fuck. This isn't my line. Sorry. I, I, I had to send some text. He was a bit of a loser. Perhaps that would be hey. the best way to describe it. But everyone keeps talking shit about Glenn, man. That's what got him into trouble. What's the matter? He was a top programmer. I would even say he was a genius. So he was really no trouble at all. A model employee. Hey, wait a minute. Just now you said something about him being in trouble. All right. Time to ask a fucking question. Uh, what about Mr. Elk? Was he in some kind of trouble? I'm sorry. Why would you think that? Okay, Maya, I need you to get a glass of water and just <laughs> hold it threateningly in her direction. On it. But you said Boil something about it just now. It doesn't matter. You said he got himself into trouble because he was a bit of a loser. Activating oh, really lie mode. Again. Lie mode. Only three Cyclops? I expected better from you. I guess Mr. Elk is like name. every other man with his own pile of secrets. Magatama! Yes. So, how about you tell me what kind of trouble Mr. Elk was in? I'm sorry, sir, but we don't deal with troubleshooting here. Jesus fucking Christ. How have your employees not torn you to shreds? I mean, I... Oh. That's because they've lost part of their their mind. I don't know, man. Glenn, Glenn seemed like a pretty stable guy other than the gambling addiction. Look at that smile. Look at that million dollar smile. That I'd was... buy that a steak dinner. That photo was taken on his first day at the company. Is... No, that's not true. That's how he looked. Look at look how happy he looks in this photo. He's all chipper, having a, enjoying a coffee. He's dead. <laughs> no, not yet. No, he he's hasn't dead. Hasn't quite worked its way through his entire system yet. He died <laughs> instantly. Not no. I yes. Know that. Anyway. Yeah, he was like halfway through his first sip, and then he just collapsed. Uh, Miss Basil, let me ask you something. Did Mr. Elg's troubles have something to do with this? Uh, uh well, it could be that. Uh. Could be this. You know, it, could be, uh, <laughs> it could be a mis MC. You think, you think his troubles was that he fucking died? It could be. It could be that. Yeah. Um. Yeah. You know. It could also well, be the sports paper. Potassium cyanide. Honestly, this could be several things. Onion powder addiction. All right. I'm just gonna take I a shot here. I haven't made the onion powder joke this stream yet. No, I feel like such a failure. No, it, it can't be the lottery ticket. I'm gonna go with the sports paper. Well, what do you think? I'm not sure. Let me ask one of the programmers. Excuse me, employee number zero, 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 one. Can you answer this man's query, please? What are you people? Great, stop uh, speaking! Amazingly. So I'm afraid that is the situation you see. Did you good people follow all that? That was meaningless sci-fi bullshit. It is exactly as my programmer explained. Alright, cool. Would you like to input another question? I, I, I guess. I can't save, by the way. It's just making that clear. Um, I'm aware. What is that? A lottery ticket. There were a ton of these on the victim's table at the scene of the crime. And what is the relevance of that? So Victor... Mm, he had a... The victim... You good? He had a hambling gambit, didn't he? That's the one. Thank you. 
got somebody. I don't think that's a logical conclusion based on the facts. No. Everyone dreams of being rich. Even I listen to Millionaire Radio. But do you buy 15 tickets every week? The lottery, horse racing. He bought a lot of tickets and lost a lot of times. That's gotta have hurt his wallet pretty bad, don't you think? Maybe bad enough to be the cause of some pretty serious trouble, perhaps? <gasps> Careful, you're gonna hurt yourself. You are right. Glenn did have a gambling habit. You good people must not follow his example. Do you understand? Mm. Even if I wanted to, I don't exactly have the money to buy any. But if you win, there's no problem, is there? That's a fallacy. And Glenn had a winning ticket, didn't he? For half a million dollars? Yeah, but then he died. It's hard to imagine how he could have been in trouble then, isn't it? Wait, how did you know that he had a ticket for half a million dollars? How did... How Your social you know security number is... <laughs> <laughs> Deep trouble? What do you mean? Mr. Elga's real problem was with someone or something most terrifying and ferocious. I... Um, okay, hold on, what? Some... Is someone or something. Someone! I don't want to present a profile. Presenting profiles is lame. You know who it is. It says terrifying it's and ferocious. And lame. I don't wanna. Damn, he's 42. Just <laughs> present Maya. You know it's Maya. <laughs> it's no, I don't think it's Maya, dude. It's me. <laughs> it's Marcus. <laughs> it's Marcus. <laughs> it's always Marcus. It's Marcus Godo. El Tigre. The boss of a loan office called Tender Lender. Tender Lender. People with businesses should think harder before naming their offices. Yeah, okay. Blue Screen Inc. Our you want people you want to inspire confidence in your tech firm. You don't name after you don't name it after a fatal catastrophic system failure. But that's your line. I, I, I don't care. Our firm is doing very well at the moment. I don't think we need to borrow money. No, no, no. She, I mean by Mr. L. She just said that they don't do troubleshooting. Why are they called blue screen? You think Glenn had something to do with this, Furio T. That Gray? That's a good question. Yeah. I'm sorry, I don't know of any connection between the two of them. Really? Because I've got proof that Mr. Elg and the Tiger knew each other. It's like, mm -hmm. I can understand them being called Blue Screen Inc. if they're, like, specialized in, like, tech support and, like, troubleshooting and, like, stuff like that. But, like, if they don't do any of that stuff and they just do, like, programming, why are they called Blue Screen Inc.? It's not this. That was worth a shot. <laughs> this is a zombie. Oh, if it's not that, then it's... I don't think you can... I don't think you can do oh, this right now. I'm dumb. I'm dumb. Never mind, maybe you can. A Furio Tigre, a tanker, is the boss of a loan office called Tenderland there. This is who Mr. Elg met with on the day of his murder. And the only thing a loan shark would talk with him about would be his death. It's true that Glenn had racked up quite a bit of debt from his gambling habit. About one hundred thousand dollars, I think. Jeepers. Hundred thousand bucks, yowza. But I heard he won the lottery, so he should have been in the clear. Shame Maggie couldn't get a bit of that good luck. Okay, so the guy who got lucky and won the lottery. But what if he hadn't won? What was his plan then? Well, this isn't easy to say, but... He said he would use his talents to, re to repay the money. His talents?
I suspect he was talking about programming. <laughs> what computer program is worth a hundred thousand dollars? Wow, that's some okay. Minecraft. Um, Windows. Windows. Perhaps 10. you good people should leave so I can get back mm, to my work. No, not Windows Ten. I'm so close what to are cracking you, Windows her. Seven defender. No, Windows Ten is worth a hundred dollars. You can get it at Best Buy. <laughs> <laughs> You're right, Windows. Uh, you and you it? don't have it yet. The program in question. Yeah, I don't have that yet. Wait. Oh, maybe? Oh, wait. No, true. Good shit. Oh no. My oh, my God. Damn. I'm pretty sure that is the right answer. It's just you don't have the correct information on the evidence yet. Oh, my God. All right, time to go back to the office and just, like, put, put this into my most important computer. Just to see what happens. Yeah, I can't wait for you to plug into your computer and it just explodes. Do, 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 Downloading do, malware. Do, do, it's do, not even, do, like, do. subtle. Oh, Downloading shit. Downloading malware. January 7th, Tension Center. Visitor's room. Oh, we, might, we might have to pause here. Oh, oh let's oh. go. Oh! Mr. Wright! It's Maggie! They finished questioning you? Luckily, the other character I have to do is Maggie, and her voice is pretty easy. Wasn't it just unbelievable in court today, sir? I'm going to stay up all night and blog about everything that happened. Because Maggie, for you're some in reason, prison. They still let me do blog talks in here. Weren't you scared? It was pretty touch and go in there. Yeah, but you totally nailed that old man. Like to Whoa, a cross there. Yeah, I did. And crucified yeah, I did. Him. in the middle of a courtroom. Well, it was all over the place with his testimony. He's not the only one. Huh? What do you mean? Everyone else's testimonies don't match up either. Not with what I remember of the incident, anyway. Hmm. I got, I got, can we, can we pause here? Damn it. Yeah. All right, fine. Hey, bro. I'm trying <laughs> yeah. to save my game, bro. Okay, go, go, <laughs> save. Just a couple more times. Like, like pause for a little or pause for the day? For the day. Oh, we're done. Okay. Yeah, we're done. Just a couple, just one or two, one or two more. Just have to be sure. Whatever you do, do not turn the game off in the middle of a save, though. That will... That would be catastrophic. I can time this. I can time That's this. True. No. <laughs> no, don't risk it. No oh, shit. Nailed he it. got it. <laughs> Alright. With that, I've saved the day, everybody. Good night! <laughs>